screen. Welcome back to the Masters of Modern uh, live stream. My camera is off for some reason. I'm going to turn it on back on, but that doesn't matter as much as hello and welcome. Or maybe it does. My camera is broken here too. Everything's going crazy. But uh, I am your host, Alex Kessler, here with my wonderful co-host, Ben Bateman, who's sleeping up his deck because I reminded him at least four times this weekend that I needed to build a deck for this stream. And two wonderful good guests, job. Joe and Chase. Uh, how's it going, everybody? Yeah, yeah. What's up? What's I'm, up? I'm excited. I'm excited to do this specifically. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, no, this is, is going to be fucking badass. Yeah, so, so to, 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 to briefly explain what is going on, uh, we are each playing uh, a commander deck built around a commander from The Walking Dead. And the way this started is that uh, Wizards released a, a product that uh, was through the secret layer shenanigans. And in that, this is the first time they've ever printed something exclusive. Well, that's not true. Back in the day, Mana Vault was printed exclusively in books, but for in a very long time, exclusively not available in packs or in a limited release format. People were very unhappy about that. There's a whole thing about it. We don't really need to get into that. But because of that, there's like bad blood around these commanders, but they're cool and people like them. And if people like them, they should be allowed to. And people on the internet should not be mean to them. So, uh, as the paladin slash uh, tank that I am and the need for internet spite, I am here encouraging people to play <laughs> these commanders on this stream uh, and giving people that want to play these characters who love them a chance to get to, to hang out and play them without being hated on. So that is what we're doing today. Uh, as I fix my camera, I'm going to have each of you go and introduce yourself where people can find you on the internet and then uh, do a little bit of a mini deck tech. And then we'll get started. Uh, so first, yeah. uh, Joseph. What's up, uh, everybody? Joe Johnson, uh, aka Black Nito. Uh, that's pretty much my social on like everything now. Uh, I just like just made a TikTok like a week ago. <laughs> Already famous. Already famous. <laughs> it's just, it's like Vine, like Vine 2.0 with like extra steps. So. <laughs> Uh, but I'm one, uh, one half of I Hate Your Deck. Uh, we just dropped our fourth episode a couple days ago. Uh, you can find that on YouTube. Uh, we're also on all the socials and some form of another. Sometimes it's like a bunch of underscores with I Hate Your Deck and all that. But if you Google it, it should be easy to find. Um, yeah, and we're super excited. We're just cranking these episodes out. Uh, is it cool if I drop the link to yes, our... Yes, please. Please do. Okay. Please do so. I'm going to do that. Share yeah. share all of the things as I all. continue to figure out why none of my cameras are working. I'm, like, frozen in this one. Yeah, I was like, you're looking very pensive. Um, <laughs> but that's just because you haven't... <laughs> your, your webcam doesn't <laughs> like you. But... Yeah, yeah, just, like, all of the cameras turned off at the same time. And I, my guess is it's related for some reason. All right, so mm. that camera... <laughs> is is maybe working well it's off okay so that'll help this one turn on using the power of inputs need input johnny number five is alive uh <laughs> all right well while i'm yeah. figuring this out uh chase can you uh introduce yourself to the, the internet yeah hi i'm chase also known as mana curves i'm a commander content creator um, I stream collaborative deck building and paper commander gameplay on my Twitch channel at Mana Curves. And I also write articles for TCG player about collaborative deck building as well. Um, I am playing Megan the cold blooded tonight. I have to talk about how much I thought he was so cool. Mardu and I have never had a good working relationship and, uh, I wanted to try and fix that with Megan. So this deck is really cool because it has a lot of sacrifice effect. Um, and I just think he's super cool and super fun. Um, I, I snagged the Walking Dead secret lair just because I thought it was really neat. I actually sold the um, Rick card to my friend because he was like, you don't like white, you should give it to me, and I went fair. Um, so I'm actually really excited to see what I can do with this because I haven't picked up this deck in a while because I've actually been super hesitant to play it on stream. Um, but I'm really happy that I can whip it out here and do... Uh, dumb Negan stuff and 
uh, use these Walker tokens uh, because we have a Daryl player. So I'm excited. <laughs> oh, yeah. I get to use the Walker tokens because Daryl is giving it to us. This is great. Yeah. Uh, nice. Really quickly. Thank you uh, for the raid, Mr. Bevers. Uh, and we're super excited for you and your party to be partying with us. Yeah, that worked. I know how yes. all the words work. All right, Ben, <laughs> what are you doing? Who, whom, whom may you be? I am playing Daryl. Um, what is it? Slayer of Walkers or something? Is that his name? Hunter of Walkers? Hunter of Walkers. Um, you hunt and walkers, Darryl, you slay vampires. I, yes, I kill walkers. Um, I am one half of the movie Boondock Saints. So probably, you know, I'll be a little sappy and not that good tonight. But, um, you know, good enough. <laughs> and um, my deck is is killing. My deck is killing walkers and lots of things that happen when creatures die. And there's some other sub themes in there like lands and stuff. And yeah, hopefully it's hopefully it's okay. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's it's I think it's way less powerful than the stuff I usually try to build. So you know that'll be it good. Be, It'll be good to have. Like, definitely. Uh, Definitely less aggressive. That's for this means true. we have a fighting chance. I just normally build stuff that's really like it seems really fun to kill people really like out of nowhere. And then it, when that actually happens, it actually never is as fun as I think it's going to be. So, you know, I'm now, not going to do that tonight. Now you're going to give us all gifts in the form of zombie tokens that we get to have. Yes. Yes. It's interesting because theoretically daryl and and negan don't really because negan wants us to like sacrifice things but then daryl's going to give us things to sacrifice oh yeah and i gain and i gain a lot of value off of every time a creature is sacrificed daryl like daryl's like a really powerful commander like a really powerful commander i like (laughs) go ahead (laughs) I mean, granted, it's whenever a zombie an opponent controls dies, not whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, which, like, for a little bit there as I was building this, I forgot that. But the fact that, like, Daryl has a 4 4 for 4 gives me the opportunity to draw three cards a turn, if I can do it correctly, is pretty bonkers, right? Daryl is like your value meal at Wendy's. He's definitely a 4 for 4, and, you know, we like that. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Um, and then I am playing Glenn. Uh, it ends up that I've somehow found myself c- controlling just like a blue-white battle box that has a bunch of all-foiled-out cards that can become any blue-white commander I want. So <laughs> this is the Remains of Geist uh, slash what was a not an, uh, Niambi uh, the other week. Uh, and I realized that like, oh, I have to play one of these new ones. We're doing this. Let's make it happen. And then just like Glenn... Might actually just be better with all the cards than Geist is with the cards that Geist was playing. He's easier to kill with targeted removal, but the fact that like any sword you attach to him lets you draw cards is really good. So he he is a where is where's the little thing? He is a a, a one three with Skulk, which uh, I guess is relevant. This creature can't be blocked by creatures with greater power. Uh, and whenever Glenn deals combat damage to a player, draw cards equals to that power. So he he's gonna fit in himself me some cards and uh be super sneaky skulking around drawing me cards uh i have no idea sorry that was the chat uh chase go oh so i was gonna say i actually found it very weird that daryl was the one who gave you walker tokens because originally i thought it was going to be michonne who gave you the walker tokens because she gets her wise she gets her own yeah she gets two when she enters the battlefield oh okay we'll see never mind then this is what happens when chase doesn't read the cards that she owns she just makes assumptions and it's like ah yes also realize i didn't explain my commander at all uh just glazed over the whole thing like i just brought a deck it's Uh, fine ben's ben's still sleeping his up so we're stalling for time please explain oh cool yeah no uh i i thought she was out of the the walking dead things that came out i i gravitated with her the most because i think she is the most badass on the show I actually know how to use a katana. I have several. Uh, I trained for a few years with a samurai, and I just, I just think she's a badass. So I don't have a zombie deck, and so I was like, "Ooh, I can just turn this into like black green reanimator." Uh, so that's this is my take on that, and like just putting out a bunch of zombie tokens and trying to swing with some equipment and it's like a blend of all of the my other play styles kind of all meshed into one yeah it's it was cool because it's like one of the only black green equipment tribal commanders that's really available Mm -hmm. yeah exactly and i remember that caused quite a stir because that's uh very much outside of uh golgari's uh color wheel so to speak 
So I think it's neat. I think it's really cool yeah. for me, shown. I like this. I like that this is <clears throat> w- like Wizard's way of like testing the waters, you know? Mm-hmm. Like, Absolutely. What if we did this with this? And I think it's like it's grown to like the greater conversation on like what properties can be added to magic. And it, this was really successful. It's like it sucks. I know uh, we had someone on the the podcast that works at Wizards and like we had to clear everything with the their PR team. And like the one thing they said was like, you're not allowed to talk about The Walking Dead because people just get so mad about it. And it sucks because in the end, the guy who we had on was one of the main people that helped design it and like was really proud of it before it came out. And then just like the internet was so aggressively unhappy that this thing existed when it was like kind of made out of a, from a good perspective and it sucks, but here we are. And, uh, luckily I'm, I'm glad we're able to let you guys play decks that normally people would be mad about. Uh, and yeah. yes, and like a boss, uh, yes, this is, a, it, I triple sleeved this deck, uh, mostly for the oh memes. My God. <laughs> that is why it is uh, a stack of cards. Um, Ben, how close are you? What, what would you say? Percentage of sleeved up are you? Pretty getting pretty close. I think I'll be ready to quick play in five minutes. Cool. Last maybe four minutes. We're gonna we're gonna. I'll tell some... chat the name of the deck that I I like to name my decks. So I named this deck Shit and Pants, um, <laughs> because um, I do run Lucille in here, and um, I, I I basically said it was a sacrifice deck, but I really like this because it's a treasure deck. Um, I actually need to update it with some stuff that came out in Commander Legends because there's some things that really do some wacky treasure stuff. Um, that's how long it's been since I picked this up. However, I think it's really cool because, um, treasures are always fun to do. Um, so yeah, I was like, let's make this a weird sacrifice, jank, Mardu treasure deck. <laughs> that's sweet. That Like there is, Mardu's like really good for treasures, I think. <clears throat> I think that's like really mm-hmm. cool. I just I um, I am playing with every one of the two color like protection swords in this deck, which is cool. I didn't like I bought them all. I've had them for a while, but then I bought the last two recently in foil, and I was like, I've never gotten to play with them. So I hope I get to draw one of them. Um, question for the group here. Yeah, I yeah. realize that I do not have a copy of Sundial of the Infinite, and I forgot to print one. I'm just gonna sharpie that as my hundredth card. Is that okay with everybody? Cool. Yeah. Yeah. Right, How dare almost. you not have every card you need? <laughs> I know. Well, this is the dilemma of content stuff. creation. Like, you want to come up with cool things, but sometimes you have to wait for stuff to show up. You got the right stuff oh, down. Your printer I've breaks. I've learned a lesson as a content creator. Um, as a content creator, it feels weird to write off buying cardboard on your taxes. Mm. So I've just um, <laughs> just taken to printing out cards every now and then. If I'm like man, I really want to run this card, but oh, geez, oh, oh my, it's $60. Um, and I don't know if I'm going to like this. You know, probably just, you know, proxy it. And boy, oh boy, does no one care. <laughs> and I really am appreciative <laughs> of that. You know, it's funny. I relate to you completely on this. <laughs> I proxy 100 <laughs> cards a week <laughs> for these games. <laughs> so. I I like... I've, I learned the lessons like my first job out of, out of college was working at a talent agency. And like, I was informed by all of the other mailroom staff that I got to then write off every movie ticket or like streaming service or TV show cable subscription on taxes moving forward because I was working there. And then I've now learned that you can just like, you write off, you write off what you can. <laughs> yeah, for sure. <clears throat> that's, that's the beauty of it. It's like, Oh, all right, I'm gonna go back to the commander stream. Hell, and welcome back to us being here. We're back. <laughs> oh, yeah. No, we're not. Oh God. Cat, what is happening? <laughs> this is terrible. I don't know. We're good. Just spell table quit out. If you guys can still hear me. Yes. Yeah, no, all good. right. All right. If you guys stop hearing me, say I can't hear you anymore. I guess right. that won't work because sometimes you'll be talking, which means I won't be talking, which means you won't be able to hear me. This is a just is a loop of terrible internet problems. All right, let's let's Ben, are you this ready? This is good content. <laughs> um, I I am uh, I believe so. I think. Um, I keep this hand. This is gonna go back. Yeah, let's I let's shuffle, do. I think I'm ready to go. Let's do hand keepy fun things. Thank you, Plorg oh, Plorg, for the follow. Also, thank you, K Wolf, for the resubscribe. 
Hey, that's uh, my boy. That's Kyle, that's Kyle Coppin. That's uh, uh, president of the Buy Stocks and Ben Bateman fan club. Got it. He did resubscribe with the statement, hashtag Team Bateman for life. Um, He's the guy. He's the oh, best. Shit. All right. I will All keep right. my hand. I have no idea how well this deck is going to do, but we're going to find out. I'm keeping Alex, my hand, too. I, I'm going to be completely honest with you, Alex. I put a card in this deck specifically this week because you reminded me of how good it is. And then after I saw what you were playing on Twitter, I was like, I'm going to wreck Alex with this. So I'm not going to tell you what it is, but... That makes me sad uh, and scared. I'm really hoping it happens. So. Oh, oh, I know what it is. Uh, no, you, no, you don't. Yeah, I do. It has overload. And uh, if Michael Synthlatis was also in play, we'd all be real sad. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what card you're talking about. That sounds like a good card, though. Uh, I know. Yep. I mean, I figured it out. I remember the <clears> conversation. <throat> I remember what you say to me. I, I listen. I'm a listening. Uh, I'm an active listener friend. I immediately regret telling Alex this. I thought there was no way he would figure it out. He figured it out immediately. It helped that Chase also was talking about how uh, she's ruined people's days with that card earlier this week. Oh, oh yes. I, I know exactly I was, what card this is now. I was so happy about that that tweet. I was like, yes. I did that on Olivia's stream. Olivia was like about like took her turn and she had like this insane board and I was like, well, I'm going to lose on my turn. And then all of a sudden I like was able to cash junk for free off the top of my library and then i looked at my hand and i went wait a minute oh <laughs> i can do this and it was great and everyone scooped and then i felt immediately bad well yeah it's you cast uh not armageddon jockle hops <laughs> no i didn't i didn't i did uh well essentially i did yeah if we're gonna go semantic yeah, yeah. yeah. Me metaphorically yeah. you cast jockle metaphoric hops, yokel hops. <laughs> <laughs> two um, card I'm... combo yokel hops. <laughs> I'm good. I can keep. Uh, what is it? It's shattering, sp oh. shatter spree, shattering spree, shatter spree. Uh, I did a vandal blast. Oh no, vandal blast, vandal blast. Yeah. All the one mana red. Uh, is it destroy all artifacts cards blend together verbally in my brain? There we go. I brought it up on the screen. This is the card Ben's talking about. I just want to make sure chat and the world know at large. Uh, I am also good to keep. Um, the turn order is Joe, then me, then Chase, then Ben. Oh. Okay. Cool. According to so I play table. fourth. Be, be, I, I go last because I'm playing Vandal Blast. Is that the deal, Alex? Uh, <laughs> I I actually uh, just randomized the turn order, and you got last place. I can't control. The I'm way. sure you did. I don't. Hey, Kes, can you click the yes to the cookies thing on the bottom? Yes, I so agree to cookies. Woo! Who doesn't love a cookie? I know who doesn't. Man, I haven't had cookies in so long. <laughs> I eat. I had them too recently and too often. Uh, all right. I'm ready to go whenever and when uh, Joe's ready to go. Uh, yeah, I'm ready to rock if you guys all got a hand. Let's do it. I'm good. Let's do, yeah, this. Let's do it. All right, cool. Good. And I'll play a forest, a wholesome forest, and I'll pass. Draw a card, because uh, that's what you're supposed to do. And I will play a uh, Misty Rainforest and pass. All right. Draw a card. I'll play a Marsh Flats. And I'm going to immediately uh, tap and sack it, get a uh, land, and then pass. Cool. I will play... Oh, I will play a Prismatic Vista, and I'll pass. And I guess I'll crack it now. Mama right, Angel423 cool. is super hyped to see what Ben did with his, their list, because they have also built this list. Oh, sick. sweet. So Boys. they're hyped. All right, cool. I'll draw one. I'll play a Swamp. And I'll tap two for a sword of the animist. Uh, hey, Kess. Yes. Uh, ben is upside down on the oh, stream. Yep. That's just a, I believe so Alex, I'm just trying I think to Alex tilt is capable them. of fixing this. <laughs> <laughs> uh, all right. I'm going to, I guess I'm going to draw. Ooh, that's a spicy one. Uh, I am going to. Play Azorius Chantry and return Misty Rainforest to my hand. Five, six, seven, eight. And do the good old fashioned uh, bounce, fetch, draw situation where I have to discard a card. I'm going to discard. I'm going to discard Strip Mine mm. and pass the turn. 
because I'm I'm not a jerk, you know. I'm here to play nice. <laughs> All righty, I am going to play an exotic orchard and um, pass the turn. All right, draw. I'm gonna play mountain. Does anybody have anything good on the table yet? No, nothing really. Nope. <laughs> We're building uh, a sword. <laughs> you got a what now? Oh, uh, sword, sword of the animist. Oh, but you have to have a creature for that, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. I believe uh, it's pronounced sword of the anime. Sword of the anime. <laughs> <laughs> it is. I'll play, it really I'll play Ren and Six. So I'll plus Ren and Six, and I'll get back the Prismatic Vista. Yeah, seems good. Vista in my hand. I'm all done. Cool. All right, let's tap. I'll draw. Uh, do 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 do. do. Play another plump. And I'll tap three for a Death Baron. Uh, skeletons you control and other zombies you control get plus one, plus one, and have Death Touch. But he doesn't count himself. Boo. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and I'll pass. <laughs> tap, draw. I will play Misty Rainforest. I'm going to fetch and get a um, Tundra, and then I'll play Glen, and then I will pass. Okay. Uh, um, I'm going to play, um, a mountain, tapping black, black, red, and I'm going to play, uh, this Phyrexian arena, Ooh. and I'm going to pass the turn. You love me some Phyrexian arena. I do too. Um, I need card draw in these colors, man. I'm telling you. Mardu and I don't get along. <laughs> you can draw cards with the black side, and then red can kind of draw and the red cards. side. Yeah, you can wheel. Uh, yeah, <laughs> that's true. I should probably put those in there in here. <laughs> <laughs> Alex, what did you play? I played my commander. Oh, he's the... oh, oh, because you have three mana. Got it. I have his orders. Too. When one three, whenever you'll come in as a player, draw a card equal to his power. Oh, if you bolt Glenn, I will cackle. <laughs> Sounds like a sweet idea to me. <laughs> uh, M Mama Angel says, Slander, Mardu is the best wedge. I think it's such a great wedge. It just it just doesn't like me. It it, it refuses to allow me to build it. I mean, and that is totally Mardu's fault and not myself. Yeah, I, I do think like one of the things with Negan that's interesting is that there aren't that many cool like mardu has a limited amount of what commanders you have so this allows Marchesa. you right <laughs> Marchesa. <laughs> Marchesa, at least Marchesa is like one of the few generically good right like you can you can mm -hmm. she's like she just doesn't she doesn't dictate you do anything with her she's just going to always be kind of decent yeah i'm going to tap green red i'm going to cast manamorphos sorry sorry i'm going to cast red red manamorphos for green green um, hey, Magical Hacker. Hey, Ryan Ramberg. I will draw. What's up, Ryan? And then I will use my green green plus this green. And I will play Ayula's Influence. And then I will discard Prism. It's the create a 2-2 two -two bear version of Seismic Assault. I can make 2-2 two -two bears by discarding a land. Oh, yes. okay. I'll discard this Prismatic Vista to Isla's Influence to make a 2-2, two -two, and then I'll plus Ren and Six to get it back. And I will end my turn. Noise. That tech, though. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'm going to draw. I'm going to play a Twilight Mire. Uh, Actually, it makes, it makes sense that Ayula's Influence is in there because, you know, Daryl's a hunter, and you can hunt bears. That's true. Um, That's true. Play yeah. her win for the win, right? <laughs> Oh, we lost Ben. Please, please uh -oh. have not lost everyone. Just Ben. Ben. <laughs> <laughs> ben didn't like my bear joke. I know he's like, oh, wait, no, no, no. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm back. You guys all turned into like sound in hey, a tunnel for a second. Okay. Uh, oh, can you refresh to get, bring yourself back into the the game? Oh, there we go. You're back. Yeah. I see you. Hey. Oh, that again for me. Huh? No, no, we can see you. You're good. We just thought you really didn't like. Chase's Hello? bear joke. Hi, can you hear us? Yeah. Yes, you, it sounded that, that weird thing happened where it sounded like everybody's in a, in a blender for a second, but I'm back. Hmm. All right. Uh, so I dropped the Twilight Mire. I'm going to tap it, tap two to uh, equip my Death Baron uh, with the Sword of the Animist. 
Uh, and then I'm going to go to combat. And sorry, Ben, I know you got that bear over there protecting your Ren and Six, but that's too much value. I have to uh, <laughs> come at that Ren and Six. How big is the thing you're coming at my Ren and Six with? Uh, three, three. And then when it, uh, when it swings. Yeah, it's blockable. It's just a three, three. And then when it swings, I get to search my library for a basic land, put it in, in the field tap. So I'm you're coming at search. with um the forest man. three three creature eh? well Ren and six all um we have to wait till seven okay we have time i'll block i will block uh the with my two two and Correct. my two tool just die cool cool or do you have uh, and, six and then second cool. What are they, Alex? I appreciate that your sleeves currently match your command. Uh, you have the planes. My Ren and Six? Play. Yes, I am playing with Ren and Six sleeves. I was lucky enough nice. to find a hundred of. These must have been from <laughs> these must have been from a Magic Fest season that I went to a few of because I had like 200 of them in a box. Oh, damn. Uh, and I guess second main, I'll tap to play the Zulaport Cutthroat. Uh, and I'll pass my turn. Whenever a creature dies, it's one to each of us and you gain one? Uh... Whenever a creature on that I control dies, uh, everyone I drain one for each creature. I love Zillapore Cutthroat. That's a card kind of near and dear to my heart. Hell yeah! So how how problematic is Red and Six? Do we think? Um, I'm literally just I'm I'm literally making a two two a turn. That's what Red every and Six time, is doing for me. Every time I think about Ren and Six, I think about modern and modern's scary, and I don't like it. So you should kill it. I'm not going to kill yeah. it. I just don't want it to, to ultimate anytime soon. And I don't want to like forget. And then like Ben's able to put a board position in the next two turns where he'll be able to ultimate. And we won't be able to do anything about it. So I'm going to, I'm going to uh, cast them all the skyclaves onto Glenn. Uh, so Maul the Skyclaves is when it enters the battlefield, attach it to a target creature. Uh, you control equipped creature gets plus two, plus two flying and first strike. Um, so Glenn is a, hang on, hang on. Okay. I, I, so, so, Glenn's a 1-3, right? Glenn is a 1-3. You're trying to Skyclaves up. Uh, so that would make Glenn 3 power, and Glenn would come at me and bring Ren down to 2. Theoretically, that would be what happens if I attack Glenn. Are you going to attack Glenn if, if, I, if that resolves? If I attack Glenn, I don't draw as many cards as I could draw. That's not to say I won't attack Ren. <laughs> Ooh, the internet's telling me right. to draw cards, though. <laughs> Draw cards, Alex. That's fine. You can. You can. But you're them. saying you're Don't saying all right with zero deals on the table. I'm just. It's. I Ren and Six is just a planeswalker. It doesn't doing anything right yeah, now. Yeah, and I'm not killing Dude, it. Right I'm just preventing it from ultimating. I'm going to attack Ren and Six. For three. Uh, for three in the air. Sure. Ren goes down to two. Cool. And I'm done. See, it wasn't that bad. It could have been worse. Alrighty. Untap. Upkeep. I will lose a life. Draw a card and then draw a card for my draw step. So boom, boom. Oh yay, that's cool. Thank you for the follow, Ojo, Ojo Bay and Choingler. I'm trying. Oko is just All the right. planeswalker, says Elk. Then one, two, three, and four, and I'm going to play a Smothering Tithe. Mm. So is that whenever Ooh. any of us cast a spell, you get a thing unless we pay one? Draw a card. No, it's whenever you yep. draw a card. Draw a card, pay two, or she gets a treasure. Yeah. It's really good. It is really good. I like it. And I'm passing the turn. All right. And tap. Keep the draw. Would you like to pay two? Uh, nope. You go ahead. Get your thing. My Walking Dead treasure token. Woo! Let's go ahead and... I don't think there's any, like, one toughness things out there that need to die this turn, right? I mean, you can try... You can kill my Zulaport Cutthroat. It's a one toughness. Oh, yeah. Zulaport's really kind of a pain in the butt. I do love that card. I mean, I ain't playing Golgari, so... I don't mind him dying. You mean he's a pain <laughs> in the throat? <laughs> hey <-o>. uh, <laughs> Cutting edge humor on the MMCast live stream. I did, um, I did I'm going to discard, I'm gonna discard this sheltered thicket to Iola's influence and make a 2-2. Mm -hmm. And then I will plus Ren and Six and get back my sheltered thicket. Seems too good. Just a free 2-2 wow, two -two every him. turn. Crazy. <laughs> um, I don't trust it. <laughs> <laughs> and 
then I think the next thing I'll do here is I'm gonna cast Thousand Year Elixir. Um and then I'm also gonna cast I'm sorry, and then I'm also going to play this Prismatic Vista, which I'll crack. I'll go down to 38. Uh, I will put into play an untapped forest, and then I'm going to cast Basilisk Collar and not equip it to anything, and I'm going to end my turn. How did you cast so many things? <laughs> <laughs> All the value. That was like 10 things. It was a lot of things. I agree. Felt really good. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can have a spicy turn. I'm going to draw. Uh, all right, I'll play. Yeah, I'll play another Swamp. And I can get, get my girl out. Uh, which I The person with Phyrexian Arena and Smothering Tide is worried about Renin 6? Hmm. Yeah, right? Exactly. That's exactly right. <laughs> Joe, did you pay for oh, your two? I didn't. I did not pay, so you can draw. Or you can get a, a trip. Little little money. Bruno little Bruno Mars for you. Treasure. <laughs> <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> no, you're all right. <laughs> so I'm gonna cast my girl. Uh she comes in the battlefield. Uh create two walker tokens. I'm gonna make this walker right here. And this walker right here if you're nasty. Um <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. Spice. Coming out of them and shit. It's like, <laughs> uh, and yeah, I'm trying to, I'm trying to get that that ramp gang out. Uh, hey, Cass, you got, you got that that random six, or do we need to take another bear out? Uh, I was gonna draw cards oh, in my are turn. You, are, we, are you nuts? There's a smothering so, tide in Phyrexian Arena. My plan Arena was not, my plan was not to attack random six. I have I never played a game of Magic the Gathering in my life, so really I'm not the threat here, and we all know this. <laughs> Uh, I, I wasn't I planning on attacking Ren and Six. With my, my board state, I can't do anything about that. I can at least attack Ren and Six. Ben, look at it as a fog. You're, you could be being attacked yeah. for your life. I mean, exactly. just so you know, just so you know, because Joe, your thing's a 3-3, three, three, right? Yes. So remember that I have a shelter ticket in my hand. You saw me get oh, back. Oh, I know. And I have I'm a just, two, I'm two. Just, I'm just so I could double I'm block talking right now. You could double block. <laughs> <laughs> just, all right, all right. Fine. Chase, I got to swing at you just on principle. I'm, I'm being diplomatic here. I'm trying mm -hmm. to swing at everybody one time. So that's three, mm -hmm. a three, three little zombie wizard coming at you. And on the swing, I get to search for a basic and put it in tapped. How big is he again? Uh, he's a three, three. All righty. I'll take it. I won't be happy about it, though, but I will take it. <laughs> All right, cool. I love that. Uh, I love that. And then that is going to be, I guess, my turn because... And it was Uport. Ain't doing nothing. And they just came out. So yeah, that's it. Quick turn. All right, draw for the turn. Ooh. Ooh. I did not pay the two. Got it. That's what's Give happening. Me All right. The money. So I am also going to attack Chase with Glenn. <laughs> Why the hell? Why? Why? Because I'm also going to draw three cards and you're going to get three treasure out of it. Hey. How am I gonna draw three cards? I'm gonna three... draw. Oh yeah, I'm you. Gonna draw three cards. Okay. How big is Glenn? <laughs> he is a three-five flying first strike. This people are sucks. such savages. People are such also savages skulk. about <laughs> the Walking Dead cards. It's crazy. Okay. Uh, how many? You're drawing three. I'm gonna get three more treasures. Ye yes. Yes. Yeah. Give, See, me, give was, me all the money. This was like a team effort, you know. Um, to quote Dave Chappelle, I'm rich, bitch. Oh, man, bro. Uh, I'm going to play, <laughs> I'm gonna play <laughs> Temple of Remnant. That's awesome. I'm so excited for my bullshit turn. Hmm. Hmm. I'll keep that just on doing, Just doing hood rat thing with your friends. Uh, And then I am going to cast... Because I kind of have to. I'm going to cast Council's Judgment. Oh, come on. <laughs> and I'm gonna, strong. And, Ren and six. Ren and six. I'm, no, I'm going to choose yeah. Smothering Tithe. But, yeah, Chase, if you target Ren and six, 
Oh no, you you can't target rent. Oh wait, how does this work? Wait, wait, turn order. Who's best to choose what? So if oh, I not... choose. Ben's going to choose whatever isn't his, so we can't target Ben. Okay, I'm, gonna, I'm still going to target Smothering Tide. That's going to get out of hand. <laughs> You've already made six mana off of it. Um, I uh, am going to choose uh, the, the so enchantment that Ben has. No more bears. So, oh, the I oh, you was on, Yeah. Wait. So, I'm trying to remember how this works. So if you choose, so, if you choose smothering tithe, Joe can choose your bear enchantment to make it go away. If you choose bottle. something that Joe controls, then Joe gets to decide of the three things chosen which thing he likes the least. Oh, whoa, whoa! Don't be looking over here. Ain't nothing. <laughs> <laughs> so, so either you either can guarantee oh. that smothering tithe goes away, or you can. Hope that it goes away and choose something else and hope your thing doesn't get chosen. So if I hit Smothering Tithe... Then Joe hits Ayula's influence and they both go. Which I won't. Oh. But if you hit something different, we can talk about this now, fam. If you want. <laughs> I have not touched anything of your Joe's. I've respected you these past yeah, 24 yeah, minutes. Exactly. And I think that you should Joe, choose I, something Ben I, controls. I, I think it's a strong move for me to just choose Smothering Tithe, and Joe, you just choose something else. We just get rid of Smothering Tithe. That seems totally safe to me. You right? You right? Let's uh, just, let's uh, just be, wait, 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 wait. You know just, what I'm just, I mean, Ben, are you choosing Smothering Tithe? <laughs> yep. Well, only if only if my man Joe here agrees. I got you, fam. Not, I got you. Let's do this. Not gonna pick Ayla's influence. Okay. Alex, you already chose, right? Yeah, yeah. I have no vote here. I feel betrayed. Yeah, I'm gonna go with Smothering Tide. I made no no allegiances yet. I just I'm out here with walkers. That's it. I'm playing Golgari. All right, so I'm gonna you, pick. So you got it. Yeah, go ahead. I'm gonna pick. Um, yeah, I'm gonna pick Smothering Tide. Just to, I hate everyone here. Yeah, we everyone sorry. here is horrible, and I will be blocking you all on Twitter <laughs> once this game ends. Uh, I'm done. Alrighty. Just just chase uh, chase, chase, chase. Remember all remember. Fault. Technically, that, it was okay. that that Ben and Joe both collaborated collaborated to only hit your thing. They weren't they weren't uh, willing to to do anything. You put the that. thought in their heads. You Kessler. did put the thought out there. Even. That's true. That's that blue white tactic. A... Yeah. Soaring. <laughs> uh, Chat's got a point that Thousand Year Elixir is also terrifying as cards that we're not paying attention to. Um, I'm going to sacrifice. Oh, actually, I'm going to do one, two. Actually, one, two, three, four, and five to play Negan. Uh, so here's the deal. Uh, Joe, you have the most creatures, so I'm so sorry, but I'm choosing you. Okay. So, how this is going to work is I am going to. To make this easier for uh, spell table play, we're going to number your creatures one through four. Starting from left to right, we'll go Death Baron one, Zulpar Cutthroat two, Walker three, four, and five, and so on. Okay? Gotcha. So what you're going to do is you secretly choose a creature in your head based on the number. I will choose a creature secretly in my head based on the number. Then on the count of the three, we'll just like hold out our hand of the number. And then, uh, you know, whatever uh, number we hold uh, gets sacrificed. Sound good? Wait, so if if we match, then... Only one. But if they're different, both go. Oh, my God. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome. <laughs> this is why I chose this guy. He's cool. Oh, uh, okay. All right. So... <laughs> Okay, no. so one, two, two three, four, three. and five. So there's five creatures on your board. Choose a number between one and five, and I will choose a number between one and five. And on the count of three, we will reveal it, okay? Okay, all right, cool. I got you. Yep. All righty. Uh, okay, one, two, three, Mama, no! go. <laughs> Damn it! Okay, all right, cool. Yes, yes, okay. yes, yes. So your token's gone. Yes. I get another treasure. Oh, yes. All right, cool. And then uh, each opponent takes uh, a life, and I gain a life. Okay. All right. So I lose a life here. I go down to 37. Mm hmm. So. Alrighty. Okay, gotcha. Yep, go ahead. No, you're good. Uh, I'm going to 
tap a red and sack a token to play Lucille. <laughs> Whoa. Oh boy. Here we go. Ah, it's shit and pants time. Uh, <laughs> Megan doesn't have haste though, which I'm very sad about. But um, you know, we work with what we got. Um Yeah, I am uh, going to I guess hold off, you know, pass the turn and the like. All right. I untap initial upkeep and then draw. <laughs> There's so many silly cards in this deck. <laughs> what was I thinking? Um <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I don't know why but I loved that you talked to yourself he went he, he yes <laughs> I mean guys I just drew impulsive pilferer so you know it should tell you something about this deck mm. I don't even know what that card uh, does I'm gonna look it up <laughs> it's just an encore card that I was like all players having creatures that die seems good and then I was like wait it only triggers when zombies die and then I didn't have time to change the deck got it um, got it but you do so get you do, so there you, do, you do ramp with it it gets you treasures yeah. yeah, it's not bad. It's not yeah. bad. Um, all right, let's think here. I'm going to play... It's got to be an untapped source. Yeah. Uh, the bot does let you pull up cards in chat. So uh, I believe it's like... Impulsive Pilferer. Uh, to the folks in chat, I can pull up my Negan deck list. Um, I need to update it with uh, Commander Legend cards because some cool stuff came out. Uh, in there but i'll show you what i have recently um which is uh you know i'm gonna drop it in chat right now the negan deck list okay i'm going to plus up run and six get back this prismatic vista play it i'll go down to 36 um crack it get a mountain Then uh, I'm then going to cast Daryl. Any responses from you, Alex? <laughs> no, no, no. Why would I counter your commander, Alex? Oh, can you not hear me? Please, please. Oh. Huh? Yes. Sorry, you were just quiet, and I was oh, like, "Oh, oh, oh, sorry. I'm here. I'm here." <laughs> I'm scheming. I'm scheming. Uh, you're good. You're good. You're good. Oh, why would I counter your commander? Because you're a jerk. Um, okay. Wow, well wow, then. Wow, wow. Honesty hour. Who are you giving the? Oh, it's at the beginning of your upkeep target. Yeah, it, doesn't trigger, it doesn't trigger till my upkeep. So that card is saying. way better That's, than oh, I dude. thought it was. I own a lot of cards that I don't read. Uh, mood, okay mood. then the next thing i'm gonna do <laughs> is i already did the thing i already made the thing i got one mana open yep i'm not gonna i'm not gonna cast anything else i already activated run and six so i'm done um really really quickly since we're at the end of all four of our turns i want to do a, a secondary introduction shout out just because the internet has been weird and i'm now also recording this separately just in case as a video that will be going up so welcome to our monday night commander stream i'm alex kessel your host with my co-host ben bateman here with two wonderful guests joseph and chase who are both and we're all playing uh, uh walking dead commanders this is the uh the 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 walking dead secret layer cards that they printed last year um uh, there's a long story about people being mean to other people and we're not on that train and we're here to suck up all of that hate and turn it into good feelings and good vibes with and try them out see how they do uh i am playing glenn ben is playing daryl chase is playing negan and joseph is playing michon which i think is how you say it because i michon michon michon, michon. 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 cool we got there. Pronunciations are hard. <laughs> uh, really quickly, uh, Joe and Chase, can, can you let people know where you are, whom, whom and where they may find you? Joe first. Oh, uh, yeah. Ladies first. Oh, yeah. Chase oh, first. Um, so, hi. I'm Chase, also known as Mana Curves. You can find me everywhere at Mana Curves, commander content creator, a streamer. I write articles for TCG Player about collaborative deck building, and I stream paper commander gameplay, too. I'm playing Negan because, um, God, the character's so garbage on the show. But this ability is so cool, and I just can't help but find it really cool that I literally take a baseball bat, kill a person, and they come back to life as a zombie. I think that's pretty sick. 
the Joe's. flavor is there, Joe. Joe. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's definitely there. Uh, what up, y'all? Uh, my name is Joe, aka Black Nito, on all the socials. Um, uh, yeah, I'm playing today. Oh, yeah, one half of I Hate Your Deck. We just dropped episode four through the link in the comments if you guys want to check it out. Uh, next, I think, like, no, seven, eight days, uh, we'll be dropping episode five for Patreon members. And on the 19th, uh, it'll be out for everybody. I was cranking things out. Uh, so please go check it out if you like some, uh, you know, commander content. You want to see some uh, old LGS feels. Uh, I'm playing Michonne. Uh, I don't have a, like, zombie equipment deck. And I figured, hey, this is, like, the time to build one. So I'm just digging her because she's got the sore work. And I, you know, I, I got many katanas in the house. And, you know, I train with a samurai. So I, I respect it. I respect, a, you know, a woman with a, with a sword. Protect your neck. Wu-Tang. <laughs> <laughs> um i'm playing glenn uh who is just one in a long line of blue white uh creatures who are good at strapping swords onto and attacking people while you play control cards and then ben is playing uh daryl ben yep hunter of walkers uh he's four four for four norman Reedus, very handsome guy ride the motorcycle well deals two damage <laughs> to target creature when he taps Beginning of upkeep, uh, I get to give target opponent three walker tokens, and whenever an, a zombie an opponent controls dies, I draw a card. This is very fun because uh, Alex suggests that I use this card because it dates back to a deck I built many years ago on the podcast called Hunted Handsome that we all liked a lot. And we talked about using all the hunted creatures and then killing them for value. Um, Daryl is way better than all the hunted creatures by like a significant margin. So uh, it's, you know, it's, it's getting to do that same kind of fun thing. And then I, I have some other shenanigans going on here with it as well, like land stuff with Ren 6, but Daryl's real sweet. Okay. All right. Uh, Joe, you, it's your turn. Oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, Joe, how many walkers do you have over there? Just one. Cool. Anybody else have any walkers or just you? I think that's it as far yeah. as walkers go. Yeah. Okay, yeah, sweet. Cool. Joe, I got to say the the like the like preview thumbnail, I suppose, for uh, the most recent episode of I Hate Your Deck. When I first saw it, I kid you not, I thought you were bear hugging uh, your that's, opponent. That's what everybody <laughs> keeps saying. They were just like, dude, I thought you were just like hugging the person. Like, what, <laughs> what happened in that game that you were just over there just like just tagging them on? I'm like, I'm like, nothing, nothing happened, man. I just that's just how they, they mesh it together. I don't put that stuff together. I'm not a I'm not a designer. So whatever <laughs> whatever they come out with, this is what happens. So <laughs> hey, hey. <laughs> You like a, you like a good hug, all right? I feel like there's yeah, no that's it. Like that. no hug it. Yeah, you gotta hug it up. You gotta, gotta hug it out sometimes. You were skin hungry. You gotta get that skin contact. Otherwise, you yeah. like start losing vitamins. <laughs> we all got tested. It was cool, you know. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm gonna I'm gonna drop on my turn. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna take I'm gonna take that too, just in case, just so I can kind of even myself. So then anybody looking at me like you got the most life, let me hit you, and I'm like, no, nah, no. Nah. <laughs> Uh, all right, I'm going to use uh, one Swamp, and I'm going to play a Commander's Plate. I've actually never played this card yet. Um, it gets plus three, plus three, has protection from each color that's not in my color identity. Uh, and to equip a Commander, it's three. To equip a regular creature, it's five. That um, card is good. I love it. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's go ahead and uh, tap three. Go ahead and equip that to Michonne. So and Michonne would she, become a so she would six, be a six, six six, and if she's, so then okay has to be blocked. Uh, she yeah she she must be blocked if able, uh, as long as she's equipped and then at least two zombies attack with her she gains indestructible which I only have one. And she's protection from what colors if she gets it equipped? Uh, red, Everything. white, and blue. Yeah. Red, white, and blue. That's pretty. Uh, that's pretty hard. Do we have a good way of killing? Do you have a good way of killing Michonne? Because in red, it's all pretty much I've got. Alrighty, I'd like to respond to the equip, if that's sure. okay. Uh, sack of treasure. Uh, let's swords, Michonne. Yep. Wow. She's gone. Wow. See now, I'll try to I try to make my life even. Now I'm back up. <laughs> <laughs> See, I it, this was really a gift to you. <laughs> Alright, Michonne is gone. Um, all right, let's tap four, and I'm gonna play uh, Liliana. Walker of the Dead. Ooh. Which one and, is that? Um, she's the new one from M21. Uh, I can plus her to make everyone discard a card. I can minus. Uh, Tar Creature gets 
minus X minus X, whereas X number of cars in my graveyard. And then our mm. alt is pretty crazy. At the beginning of combat on my turn, target creature, target creature from a from a graveyard into play and it gains haste. That's that's nasty. So I know mm. that no one's gonna let that happen. Uh, so <laughs> uh, I'm just gonna plus her, and each player discards a card on uh, each opponent who cannot lose three life. Uh, I am dis- gonna discard a blood crypt. I'm I'll discard starting. this impulse. I'll discard this impulsive pilfer. I'm gonna discard okay. this R of silence. Ooh, clever mm-hmm. trick, Kazan. Discarding Gary. Discarding Gary. And um, yeah, you got Nick. How big is how big is Nick? Is a four three. Four three. Okay. And yeah. he has a bat, so you should be scared. That's true. That's true. Look at but, it. Uh, yeah, I gotta. Okay, all right, we're going we're gonna to divide and conquer here. We're going to divide and conquer. All right, so Kess, I haven't hit you yet. I feel it's only fair to swing at you with my blood, my Death Baron uh, just to get it all around so I can a little ramp. I but think that's fair. Um, I'm going to leave these other two guys here to block my Lily. They're just trying to, you know, you see they're trying to hold it down. So uh, Kess, take three, and I'm going to get that uh, okay. sword trigger. I'll get a swamp. All right, I might, I might have to, you know, get a little bit of revenge, but not a lot of revenge. No, so yeah, I mean, you know, it's, it's all good. You know, we're we're not we're not trying to trying to be mean. Yeah, we're just trying to, you know, little pokies, little pokies. Yeah, that's I it. Get it. And uh, get uh, it. <laughs> after that, that's going to be my turn. Got one card in hand. I need card draw. Uh, I'm going to untap. I'm going to draw for the turn. I'm going to remember what I left on top using the power of scry. <laughs> I'm going to debate in my head what i should do next uh i could do that and get that which sounds cool yeah but then i don't really do anything well i guess i do a little bit oh i guess i do that that's cool all right uh i'm gonna do that i'm going to uh transmute to laria west (laughs) oh noise one of the all-timers uh one of my favorite things to do in general is, is transmute this card. I'm going to find myself a Hall of Heliod. It's generosity. Why, why, That's such a good land. Why is the last word on its name? There's too many words. It's the top. Oh, no, it's not. Okay, that's flagstones. There it is. Cool. I'm going to play Hall of Heliod generosity. And then I'm going to swing at Liliana. All right. How much? Uh, three. She's taking three. I have no flyers. Uh, does he have first strike? He doesn't have vigilance though, right? Cool. Yep. And then I'm done. Okay. Untap. Upkeep. Draw two. Lose one. I'm dying to my own Phyrexian Arena. <laughs> sometimes you, you, um, you live by the sword and sometimes you die by the arena. You mean the bat? Ah ha ha. Ah ha ha. Sorry. <laughs> Here I am thinking I'm clever as hell. <laughs> um, okay. Uh, we're gonna do uh one two uh black black and uh, white for five. Sorry, I gotta rearrange everything. It's a little cluttered over here. Um, to play uh, ogre slumlord. Is that whenever a creature dies, something happens? Whenever another non-token creature dies, you may put a one-one black rat creature token onto the battlefield. Non-token, gotcha. Um, what's the what are the two things surrounding Negan there? The what? The on two a, things. The two cards sur- on either side. The of Negan, treasure you know, tokens and Lucille. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Okay. Um, one, two, three, and four. I will equip Lucille to Negan. Can you remind me again what Lucille does? Yes. Uh, two zero and menace. Whenever equipped creature attacks, defending player sacks the creature. If they do, I create a Walker token. Sounds good to me. Mm-hmm. Alrighty. <sighs> Let's see. Um, so what, Negan's a five four now. Uh, Negan is a six uh six three. Six three, got it. Yeah. So I am going to move to combat. And let's see. You don't want to come um, to me. 
Liliana will keep making us discard cards. I'm going to swing at, um, let's see. I will move to combat. I will be swinging at Joe. The attack trigger will happen, so Joe, you have to sacrifice a creature. Well, I'm that swinging at Liliana. I am I'm swinging at Liliana, I should say. I'm going to respond to that trigger. Okay. Um, in response to that trigger, I am going to tap Daryl and do two to your walker, Joe. Oh, man. Y'all are just... I need, that's I need the value. <laughs> I need the value. Everybody's just ganging up on the brother. All right, cool. I see how I it just, is. That's the, only, that's the only one I could draw a card off of, man. I need I didn't, it. I didn't, like oh. discard, I didn't want to discard a card. That was messed up. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, we're going to... Everybody take one. I gain one. I'm so Very sorry, fun. Joe. Wait, you only did two damage to it. How big is the, how big is your walker? It's a three three. Ooh. Why is it a three three? Death Baron. That's okay, well, one plus one it, it's, and... it's, it's cool because a thousand year elixir. I was gonna have to do a second one anyway, so I'll untap and then do the other two to it. Oh Jesus Christ! Okay. <laughs> All right. you, know, you got both. You got both uses out of it. So. All right. Well, everybody takes one. I gain one. All right. Uh, so uh, trigger uh, will now resolve. Joe, you have to sacrifice a creature. Suppose I'll just get rid of my Death Baron now because he's the only one. And I can't block because he has Menace. Yeah, I'll get another treasure token and I will get a rat. Oh, whoa, that's a cool looking rat. Just kidding. Uh, another cool. another Zulaport uh, trigger for everybody. Oh, yeah. Um, yep. If I lose one, I gain one. Boop. Okay. Um, so it is going to be six coming in at you, Joe. Six commander, I can't, I can't block, so I have oh, to I take it. Was, I thought it was coming it, at Liliana. It, it goes at Liliana. Oh yeah, it is at Liliana. Thank you, Joe. Thank you guys. Oh, for you switched it up now. Oh, okay. No, no, right, no, cool, no, 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 no. <laughs> I did originally hit Liliana. I just got, yeah. I just got really into picking on you. Um, get extremely honest. With I did you. look up Lucille to confirm the rules when she said it because I was afraid then that wouldn't trigger because it, but it does because it's defending, not yeah. not the player it attacks, which is yeah. Well, here we are. Um. And then I am going to um, sacrifice. What is the um? Oh, damn, I hate everything here. Uh, Cass, <laughs> uh, what is the artifact on Glenn? Uh, it is a uh, Mall of the Skyclaves. What does that do? Uh, it gets plus two, plus two flying in first strike. Okay. Uh, I, will I, am say, going... I will say that if you're looking for an artifact to blow up, Basil's Collar and the Elixir are both terrifying. <laughs> well, yeah, but so is a flying commander where I play a guy with a bat. I mean, like, you think that would work, but it doesn't. <laughs> uh... <laughs> just, just on the scale of scary things, <laughs> Ben's thing is scarier. Never okay. listen to Alex. Ever. Alex, He's always, is, always, always the guy you should kill. Alex, which is scarier, the collar or the, the elixir? Um, I think the elixir is prob uh you already yeah, have a commander Yeah, because that'll make it untap. Yeah, yeah he gets make two him. per turn. Elixir makes it so that it just kills anyone. So so from your perspective, I think the Basilisk Collar is scarier because well, he can use it to kill Negan forever. Because he can give he can kill anything the, forever. Because he can give Alex. Elixir? Remind me again what Mall of the Skyclaves does. Can you just read it out loud, real fast? It's a it it's uh two and a white equipment. When Mall of the Skyclaves enters the battlefield, attach it to target creature control, which has already happened. Uh, equipped creature gets plus two, plus two flying in first strike. Equipped four. I was about to say, don't you think that the the elixir is scarier for me because he can just keep on tapping Daryl and killing Negan? Oh, because Negan's a four three. Oh, because Lucille's plus two plus zero, not plus two plus two. Right. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Daryl only does. Daryl only does four. Damage. Oh, that's true. I mean, yeah. Both are bad. Yeah. Uh, well, the, tr the, the truth is, if I want to kill, if I want to kill Negan every single turn, it, one of these with Daryl is going to kill Negan every single turn. It doesn't matter which one you get rid of. If that's what I wanted to do, I don't care about Negan. You getting walkers Alexa, that I can Alexa get lets him draw a card off of one walker Actually, is good for me. I would say. You know I would say. I would say. Gonna... I would say elixir is worse because because it lets him draw. Two, he can give two zombies to anyone and then kill them both, drawing two cards a turn with it. Okay. I think I'm just going to play things close to the chest and <laughs> leverage my five, uh, you know, treasures here and see what see what happens. So I'm just going to pass the turn. Okay. I love that. It's All a right. great attitude. Let's kill Alex. All right, my turn. <laughs> wow. wow. Um, 
Wow. Let's see. I'll end of turn discard this sheltered thicket to make a 2-2. Two -two. Then I will untap. Okay, upkeep. Let's give some walkers away. Um. Oh, I forgot to make a walker token too. Uh, sorry, you guys. I do have a walker token. I I made Joe, a rat, but not a walker. I'm gonna give you three walkers, Joe. Okay. All right. We're getting we're getting progress. I see it. You, you shoot me down, and then you know you build me back up, Buttercup. Okay, I see. I'll draw for turn. Uh, according to Hannah Montana, everybody makes mistakes. And everybody has those days, so <laughs> you just gotta you gotta be like Hannah Montana. Gotta be. Why not? Isn't isn't Hannah Montana secretly not Hannah Montana? Can you can you be Listen, Hannah she, Montana? She, she is Alexis <laughs> South Dakota, but you know. <laughs> Wait, is that actually the the like the real name? Like in the show, what's her no. face? Is? Okay. <laughs> her name is Hannah Montana in the show, but her name is like Miley. It is Miley in the show. Okay, yeah, it's Miley who's pretending to be Hannah Montana. Not got it. Okay, cool. I'm here. I, this shows how much I know about Hannah Montana. Uh, ben. Yeah, let's see. So, one, two, three, five. Seems sort of reasonable to do that, I think. Let's go ahead and attempt to. Two. Three. Let's attempt to equip Basilisk Caller to Daryl. Any responses? Tapped out. No responses. Uh, nothing from me. I do um, have the best of both worlds stuck in my head, though. Let's <laughs> then go with... I will plus Ren and six. Let's get back this... Prismatic Vista. Let's play said Prismatic Vista. Land for turn. Uh, so what? I've got that. I've got that. Two two twos, got the untapped dude. Ah, I think I'm gonna also play it pretty close to the vest. I don't think I need to attack anybody. A two two bear is not gonna do anything to anyone, right? I mean no. <laughs> yeah, I'll just take it. <laughs> if you wanted to yeah. get free okay. damage in, I'm not doing I have no blockers. Yeah, but I'd rather like protect run and six and just have blockers. I'm not really like in desperate need. It's yeah, fair. I'll just it's fair. end my turn. Alright, cool. Tap. Lands, it lands. Hold on, harder cards. Let's do this. Oh, that's not terrible. How much does she cost? She cost seven now. Yeah. She uh, seven? She's a five drop? She's a five drop. Wow. Uh, and I have a bat. That's true. Well, yeah. Also a five drop. What she is a sword, back up? though. Bring out your dead. And then when she hits the battlefield, she gets two more walkers. Got some spice over here. I'm going to tap two. And I'm going to equip one of the walkers you gave me, the Sword of the Animist. Keep this ramp going. Um, How big? Wait, okay. Yeah, I don't care about that. That's fine. Yeah, I was going to say, you can just kill it anyway. I just, I just want to hit my land drops now. <laughs> uh, I'm going to come at Chase with this 3-3 three, three Walker. Or, yeah, Walker, because why not? Actually, no. That's you over there sitting pretty. I will. I'm going to go over there. <laughs> I'm swinging at the Wait, wait, player. wait, wait, wait. Before you declare. Okay. I have. If you do attack me, I have bad news. Oh Jesus Christ! <laughs> oh my God, my chest hurts. Don't, don't, don't. He's just he's 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 Hollywooding you. So, Joe, he... I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you this. 
I was um, planning on being nice and not using that bad news, but if you want to come at me with the bad news, then I'm going to come back with bad news. Well, Joe, if you, attack, if you attack me, I do have a death touch token that can block, which will kill your guy. So, That's cool. I'm down. That is I'm mine. Alright, fine. We'll just, we'll make that change. Okay. I just want, I just want ramp. I just, I just want ramp. And then, uh, uh walking by as everyone won. Game one. So wait, how did two walkers just die or one walker just die? One uh, walker two. died, and this one was a rat. Walker. It was a rat. Okay. Yeah. So I draw a card off of the walker dying, which is sick. Okay. <laughs> 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 it does. Man. It does feel like these deck, these commanders were built to play with each other, right? Like all the abilities yeah. seem to like interact yeah. in interesting ways. Totally. Uh, did you search? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. Yeah. Uh, and then I will go up here, and y'all yeah, pass. All right. So I know the, this is so, a weird question to ask. Oh. I don't know, let me let me quickly. The bad news was going to be be casting even mind sensor before you tutored, uh, which would have been oh. the mean version of me playing it after you tutored. So I waited for the the good of the fact you didn't attack me. All right, Chase, you can talk. <laughs> Sorry. I was going to say I know it's a dumb question, but do you think that in like competitive play? Uh, judges would allow the use of walker tokens as zombie tokens yes mm. i do i do I know, so. I know they're tokens but i'm always worried like they'll be like well because they come from a thing that you can't use competitively um we no, regret no. to inform you you can't i've used beast tokens as like mice tokens in competitive play <laughs> like, okay. as long as, long okay. as like as long as there is not a situation in play that would have made it confusing for what they are, you're fine. And, mm -hmm. and the name being slightly different, it, you're totally fine. Hi, Kyoji. Uh, I am going to attack someone. Uh, I'm going to attack Ben. Oh wait, you're just going to kill my. You're going to kill my friend. That's messed up. I guess you're sacrificing card draw if I do that. Yeah, I'm going to attack Ben. Wait, what are you coming at me with? Just my commander. It's a three. It's a three-five flyer. And you just want me to kill it with Basilisk color? I mean, then you don't get That's to draw. Then you, then you don't get to draw cards. Do you want to draw cards? I mean, do you like drawing cards, Ben? Sure, I'll tap and kill your commander. Okay. And I gain, uh, I gain two. Uh, I, I will play it. Shark Typhoon. Casting it. I'm casting Shark Typhoon. Mm. And I'm done. Okay. Untap. So many scary things in play. Upkeep, lose a life, draw a card, and then draw a turn. Um, hmm. Okay, this is fun. This deck um, is so. This deck is so value. It's just like this is. This might be like the most value deck I've ever built. Alex. Feels like you built this deck. <laughs> Four five. I'm gonna play. Um, actually, I'm gonna do one, two, three, and four to play a pitiless plunderer. Which one is that? Whenever another creature I control dies, I create a to uh, treasure token. Mm. That card is no longer inexpensive. I've heard tail it is not inexpensive <laughs> it is a five dollar uncommon all righty um okay i'm going to move to combat and i am going to swing um i'm gonna swing two creatures i'm gonna swing negan at kess and i'm going to swing um Let's see. Joe. Yep. How big are you, how big are your tokens over there again? Uh two twos. Or two My Death Baron is gone. Oh your Death Baron is gone. Um Hey Ben. Yep. Would you be okay in killing one of my tokens? Like you just come at me with a token and I kill it? Yeah. How big's your token? Two two. Oh, so just like trading it for a bear kind of a thing? Yeah, is that okay with you? Um, you can say no, I will not have feelings hurt, I promise. 
Uh, well, yeah, I'll just, I'll just untap. As long as you're not doing anything shenanigans, I'm just gonna untap Daryl. I'm I'll... not. Yeah, that would be mean. I'm not gonna do that. I'll just untap and block with Daryl. That's fine. Okay. So the token Walker tokens go in at you, and then uh, the attack trigger for Negan happens with Kess. So Kess, you have to sacrifice a creature. Bye, the mind sensor. Get another treasure, and then um, six commander going at Kess. Then the um, walker dies to Ben. I draw and whenever a creature I control dies, I get another treasure token. And then I get the a walker back because of Lucille's ability. Did um, Joe lose any creatures or you didn't attack Joe? Uh, I didn't, I, yeah. I didn't <clears throat> attack Joe. I was just asking because I was originally going to be like, hey, your guys are big. Kill my guy. But it didn't work out that way. Yeah, so, they, they um, tiny me again. Yeah, the itty bitty. Um, let's see. I am then going to one. Let me see. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna pass the turn. I'm gonna pass the turn. Okay, end of turn. I'll tap Daryl. Oh, actually, I gained four life off of that block. And then I'll tap and I'll deal two more to one of your walker tokens, Joe. Can I kill one of mine? No, I gave him three, so I, I think I should... I'm going to have to give three more in a second here, so... Oh, yeah, that's uh, fair, that's fair. So the four trigger, uh, everyone loses a life, I gain a life. All right. Okay. Okay. Um, my turn. I will. Let's see. A lot of cards me, 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 me. I'll discard game trail. End of turn to make a two-two. Um, and then yeah, I'll go to untap. Keep upkeep. I will give three Walker tokens to. Let's give him a cast. Nice. No. Thank you. I appreciate that. I'd like them. Let's keep One, it even, guys. I'll draw. Two. Three. Look at that. They even have the correct nice. names. So then I will... Wait. Firelit Thicket. This is the longest I've ever seen Daryl stay on board. Normally they kill it after they see me draw three cards. <laughs> Fair. <Pretty> savage. <laughs> um, all right, let's see. Mind sensor is dead. I really need like more things. So I think what I'll do here seems like a fun thing. I think what I'll do here is I'll go green, green, red, red. I'm going to play Lumberknot. Oh, what does that do? Yep. It's a 1-1 one, one hexproof whenever a creature dies with a plus one plus a counter on it. Oh. Nice fair card. Told you, this it, is, this, is, this this whole deck is just fair cards. It has Shroud, though, right? Uh, it has Hexproof. Hexproof, yeah. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yo, yo, um, yo. Let's see. That's already equipped. Don't need to spend any mana on that. So I guess probably the thing to do is just plus Ren and Six to get back Shelford Thicket. Um, so it goes up to six. Yeah, and I think I've mana open, but I'll, uh, I'll just pass the turn. Does anyone have the ability right. to do damage to Ren and Six? Nope. Um, you do if you give your uh, zombie tokens flying. That's fair. That's true. I could do that. You gotta take. You gotta take power into your own hands. I'm Put wings know. on those zombies. <laughs> All right. I'm give them some Red Bull. Wings. <laughs> 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 <Wait. laughs> need to get a note to self. Need to get Mall of the Sky Clay's Red Bull altar. <laughs> <laughs> Gives you wings. Incest, right. Daryl, Vision. Ooh, that one's good. <laughs> Thank you, Chad. Thank sure. you, House of Cards. Uh, I'm 
I'm sure this is just gonna die if I play it. Like I don't even want to play creatures anymore because <laughs> Daryl's just gonna shoot them down. <laughs> I do plan on removing things from play on my turn if I can. Ah, uh, yep. Okay. Um. I mean, and then if I equip her, you're just gonna. So yeah, I. If I promise not to swing at you, can, can I just at least want to swing with her. Ben. What is what is what does Michonne do? Um she gets indestructible if you attack with some zombies. Uh if she's equipped, she must be blocked if able, and uh she makes two tokens when she enters play. Whatever, Michonne. So do you want her to be blocked? Um I mean, she has I don't care. Blocked. I just I just wanted to swing with her. <laughs> uh, you can swing at me and I will block with one of my walkers. She has for okay. no, she has she has death touch or indestructible well, if the no, red things attack. No. Oh, I thought you were talking about me. I'm like, this isn't a rat, I promise. It's just a walker. Alright, well, I'm gonna attempt to equip her with the sword of the animist. Oh, That's I regret cool with the world. to let you do this. <laughs> <laughs> and then I'm gonna attempt to Give her the commander's plate as well. Christ. Does it have does she have trample? No. Okay. No, no, no. Okay. okay. Uh, I'm gonna tap three. I'm gonna cast a loyal subordinate. Ooh. Uh, that's menace. At the beginning of combat on my turn, uh, if you control your commander, each opponent loses three life. Jeez. Zombie. Three one. So we, uh, I lose three life. Uh yeah, so I'm gonna go to combat. Mm-hmm. I want to lose three life. Gotta say, I had um, I had my hesitations about how a Michonne deck would look, and this looks amazing. <laughs> it feels good. <laughs> it's super fun. Um, I'm going to swing Michonne and Chase for this mm -hmm. for the Negan crack back earlier. So uh, we all lost. We all just lost three. Is that what just happened? Yes, yeah. y'all lost three when I went to combat. I will then... block my Walker token. Cool, and then a sort of animus trigger. I get a land. So we just have land. one dead creature, and it's a walker. Is that the deal? Yeah, one dead yep. walker. The one, the one dead card. walker. And I will put a counter on this lumber knot. Get things started. Cool. Guys, lumber knot's about to pop off. Oh shit! God. I've never actually like used lumber. I think I might use lumber knot in limited back in the day. When oh, I, was in I, the mm, I loved lumber knot in limited back in the day. I yeah, was a big fan. I think so. That's that's the only time I can really remember using that card. It gets so big, and <laughs> it's just a big tree. It's a big tree, folk. Uh, Joe, are you all done? right? And that that is. Let me look at my hand. Yeah, everything else is too big. I'll pass. <laughs> I draw a card. Uh, I cast terminus. <laughs> Jesus. What is uh, what is Terminus? Uh, everyone puts all creatures they control under their deck. All right. I'm going to uh... have Negan go to the command zone. Wait, Ben might have responses. Fair. Really quick. Sorry. Um. I right, like what Ben's got. I needed to stop. <laughs> There's a lot. I get a 6-6 six, six yeah, in the meantime. I guess I, I probably need to... Probably put Daryl in the command zone. Um, it's a shame I'm losing Lumber Knot, but what are you going to do? Um, so Daryl is going to... Oh, I actually have a response. So Alex plays first. So you get actually first response. Yeah, okay. Um, I'm going to tap one, two, and three for a red. And let's Chaos Warp that uh, Shark Typhoon. Mm okay. We're going to shuffle this. I don't like that. I don't not, want that. Not the red and six that's going to alt in two turns, but it's fine. <laughs> no, no, you know what? You know what? Ben's been good to me. Has he? You're a, yeah. You're a 22. Well, I guess that wasn't about that my wasn't own ben. doing. Let's be honest. <laughs> <laughs> um. Okay, so that's you're going to chaos warp. So Alex yep. will reveal his card first, and then it'll be to me. Plus, Jen. What'd you flip? Uh, a flooded strand. Okay, sweet. So then I'm gonna tap Daryl. Who's got walkers that I can kill? I got oh, three. I'm so dumb. Yep. Cool. I'll kill a walker from cool. you, Joe. Everyone. Oh, actually, no, take... no. I don't. I don't want the life gain stuff. Do you have any walkers I can kill, Chase? 
No, uh, my walker is dead. You're dead? Okay. I'll kill two of your walkers, Joe. Okay. Uh, everyone oh. will take two, and I will gain two. You're killing me here. Um, <laughs> well, the Zulu Port Cutler is, is underneath my, my deck now, so... I also gain four, though. So I go up to 40, I draw two cards, and... Walker is... Bye-bye. And the Shaman is once again... The most expensive commander of all time. <laughs> Lumbernaut goes into... Yeah, Lumbernaut's going to go bottom of the deck. These mm -hmm. tokens all die. Okay, Negan's going to the command zone. Everything else is going to the bottom of the deck. And I'll put Daryl in the command zone. Uh, I'm done. Okay. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do the fetch part now, just ahead of time, for yeah. everyone's convenience, but I'm done. Okay. Okay. And I lose one life. Um, let's see. I am going to tap one, two. We got Prairie Stream. Um, three. And let's play Gadrak. Scourge Crown? Crown Scourge. Got that wrong. It's the red guy? Yeah, he's a dragon. Um, whenever, um, he can't attack unless I control four more artifacts, which I do. Um, at the beginning of my end step, I create a treasure token for each non-creature, non-token creature that died this time. Um, right. I will just go ahead and equip Lucille to him because that's really all I can do. Um, okay. you know, we love, we love, a uh, uh, <laughs> fun fact, I don't think anybody <laughs> at, um, R&D thought a dragon would be wielding a baseball bat. But um, <laughs> this is what we've come to, so I'm passing the turn. We are now in Super Smash Brothers. Oh. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Just gotta, hit that, gotta hit that smash at the right moment. King I think end of your D turn, D I'm going to discard... Uh, end of your turn, I will discard Maze of Ith, Sheltered Thicket, and Strip Mine. Yeah. And... Get some two, birds. Two, three... I'll make three bears. And then I will untap. Joe, I know you're on TikTok. Have you heard the Fortnite song on TikTok that's been plaguing it as of late? No, I haven't. Oh, shit. Okay, it's, Jim and I have uh, been talking about the song nonstop, but it's amazing. It's based on oh, what's his face? American song. Boy. American Boy by Estelle. Ooh, I need to get on that thing. And it's Number one victory royale, yeah, for a night we about to get down. Oh, get down. that's fucking funny. <laughs> it's so catchy. Tomato town. Just wiped out Tomato Town. My friend just got down. I revived him. Now we're heading southbound. Nice. Yeah, I need I need to get this. I hate right, TikTok. Gonna... It's so good. <laughs> I think I'm going to Let me see if I understand how to read this. Yes. So I am going to tap five mana. Mm -hmm. And I am going to play. I learned this one from Alex. Titania, Protector of Argoth. Ooh, Ooh Titania. Is... I always would read this card when you'd play it, Alex, and be like, you weirdo commander players, what is this? <laughs> <laughs> um, she has so many texts, so many words in her text box. <laughs> she's so good. Um, when I play her. Uh, sorry, I, I needed to do this ahead of time. Oh no, no, that's not true. Wait. Yes, yes, yes. Sorry, I, I with because I'll hold priority. I cast Titania. Uh, before it resolves, I'll crack this prismatic vista so that it's in my graveyard once the thing resolves, mm -hmm. so that it comes back. Um, I will search. Judge, I think he cheated. Cheats, McGee. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Um, 39. Judge, we were playing our Walking Dead Commander game, and he cheated. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me why my laugh sounded like a tire breaking. Um, it's a bit rough over here on my end. I'll play my land for turn. It's, it will be this it's Winslow late. Keith. We've definitely kept you uh, out past your bedtime. Yeah, you have, but it's okay. But I, I won't think that. It's 6 a.m., but, you know, we're going to vibe. We're going to vibe, because... Um, my weekends are on Wednesdays and Thursdays, so tomorrow's my Friday. Ooh, nice. Oh, nice. And then, 
I will. Does that make sense to do? Doree, what else? Fortnite, we about to get to. <laughs> I'm so I'm, sorry. I'm pulling that up because as soon as we get off the stream. <laughs> <laughs> this is my life now. It's called Chug Jug or something like that on YouTube. I'll crack both Damn, of these. Okay. I'll go to 38. I really want to drink Chug Jug with you. <laughs> <laughs> and I'll put into play a couple lands. If you can make it work for magic, Joe, I'm gonna be so happy for you. I I'm gonna I'm gonna figure out how to throw that in there. <laughs> you do like a walking uh secret lair Fortnite. <laughs> right. <laughs> um so then I get two five threes. Um, which I guess I should use different things to represent them. So I do think I do think use... Fort Fortnite is not to blame, but a a direct link can be drawn from that towards Magic bringing other IPs into its into its content. One of my favorite memes on TikTok is where uh, they'll use this audio and they'll like zoom in on a random outside of Fortnite IP, and they'll be like, "Look, it's the dude from, from Fortnite. Fortnite!" Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> it's like the alien from Alien versus Predator, and I'm like. Ooh. <laughs> kids these days <laughs> everything is from fortnite that's it's what the they, they came up fortnite. with it. i'm going to tap four mana and i'm going to cast this algae garial which is just the shroud version of lumberdot uh but it's a may trigger same card though interesting and i think that was a long worm it's also a creature type crocodile <laughs> He's a crocodile. Um, oh, and then I'm going to plus my run and six up to seven. And I will get back this. Let's just get back a windswept heath. And then I will enter my attack step. And I will come at. Who does that? Uh, no, these the, three the, things I made at the end out. of turn. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. That's right. That's right. Uh, everyone has uh, no blockers except me. I have a single blocker. I'll just come at you. Let's just go at Alex. Surprising no one. Yep. Actually, wait, wait, wait. No, I can, I can, I can go. Man, he's Joe. Guy sure, he just, has no blockers, right? He's almost the guy that just board wiped. Joe's at forty-eight. <laughs> You're at forty-eight, Joe. And my commander costs yeah. nine now. I'm actually, I'm actually, I'm, I'm, I'm actually cool here. with. I'm cool with Joe. Alex needs to die. Alex, I'm coming at you for six. <laughs> I don't even know if this deck can come back from that. Wow. Joe, wow. you're at okay. 48, and right, you're ben, doing... I'll, I'll oh, remember Garia this equipment. moment. <laughs> you're doing great. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm look, between the time you board wiped and now, I, you know, managed to recover you, by you... putting 22 power on the board. So, yep. um, I feel to okay quote, about it. To done. quote Chris Jenner, you're doing great, sweetie. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all done. And all I'm right, also cool. tapped out. All right, let's see. Do we have a lot, a lot to menus? So let's see. Come on. Hey, the bone saw, free. Bone saw. Uh, bone saw is ready. <laughs> Wait, we have an actual bone saw in play. I'm so hyped. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> bone saw bone is like saw. Hot. Bone saw. Play time. Play time is over. <laughs> Six, seven. All right, I'm going to tap seven and play a Shieldred, the Whispering One. Ooh. What does she do again? Uh, at the uh, beginning of each person's upkeep, they very sacrifice very a creature. And at the beginning of Joe's upkeep, he gets to put a creature from his graveyard into play. Yeah, which I have currently two, Death Baron and a Gary. Uh, and then I guess we'll just equip her with stuff, <laughs> make her more scary. And one, two, let's casually plays a Sealdred and has mana left over to equip her. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, and then one card left in hand, and I will pass. All right, I will untap. I will draw a card. Ooh, 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 ooh. ooh. <laughs> and I will pass my turn. All righty. Um, untap. A peep, draw a card, lose a life. I, I have to sacrifice I a creature, right? Yeah, you gotta sacrifice. Okay, yeah. I will 
draw sacrificing Gadrak. I'm very sad about that because he's the only creature I have. Is it creature? Yeah. That's a yep creature. Yeah. I'll put a counter on Algae Gariel. Mm -hmm. Sick. <laughs> mm. Alex, would you say that it's a consistent theme that in every single one of my decks I have one or two creatures that just sit there getting counters every turn? It's just like a thing. I don't know what it is. I've noticed that it's on almost every deck I build. I, I have. That's. It's not surprising. It's actually a little surprising. I guess like your general playstyle is the like tempo, and in commander, the best way to make like creatures that feel like tempo creatures are the ones that like scale well. Because you're you're benefiting off of other playing against multiple players for your one creature, it makes sense. I get it. I understand. Alrighty. Um. Negan comes into play. Uh, his ETB triggers happen. Ben, you have the most creatures, so I'm choosing you. Um, is it you have to choose me, or is it? Um, I I'm literally only choosing you just because of the fact that you have multiple creatures, which gives me the likelihood of more treasures. And two choices. Um, yeah, I'm not going oh. to swing at you though. It's just an ETB effect. Got so, it. Okay. And so, is it targeted, or do we each just? It's just we each choose. Uh, me and target opponent each secretly choose a creature that player controls. Then those choices are revealed, and that player sacrifices those creatures. Whenever an opponent sacks a creature, you create a treasure token. Got so it. okay. Um, so I have so I currently have two five three mm -hmm. uh, elementals, mm -hmm. Titania, three bears, and an algae mm -hmm. gariel. So it can go one two three four five six seven. Okay, so picking your head a number between one and seven, um, okay. and I will do the same because the number is bigger than my hand. I'm just going to um, write it down on a piece of paper? Question mark. If Remember, can... four, five, and six. Four, five, and six are my two twos. Don't forget that. Okay. Where's my flipping... Okay, here. I have a piece of paper right here. So, um... Uh, so, I, I do believe you can target the algae gharial with this. Just really? FYI. Yeah, because it's choose, not... Oh, yeah, not target. Not... Okay target you're targeting ben is that really what you want to do you really want to go after i my, never like, little... said i was going to i'm just, I, I'm I'm just bringing it up such... as, as a as a as a rules i'm sure that's why you're bringing it up alex i'm sure that's exactly why okay on the count have you chosen your creature secretly in your head uh yes i have okay so on the count of three i'm going to reveal my number and you reveal yours okay 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 one two three Okay, so uh, one of your two twos is gone and your second two two is gone. So two of your two twos are gone. I get two more treasure tokens. Two bears. Uh, my algae gharial becomes a four four. Um, and then I'm just going to pass the turn. See, I didn't want to get rid of your big creatures because we're friends. It was nice of you. I Ren appreciate it. Ren and six did survive. <laughs> Um, I'm going to discard this. Oh, Alex, I could have swung if I had creatures to swing with. That wasn't me. This, uh... <laughs> oh, oh, that's fair. That was earlier. <laughs> ben had a lot more creatures to block with at the time. I'll discard Vesuva to make a bear, and then I will untap. Um, the funny thing is, I have Renin 6 at ultimate territory, but I would be able to, like, retrace a Manamorphose, <laughs> which is, like... Oh. That's pretty good. I mean, so... I can draw... Really every land. Joe, your Shieldred actually helps me, so thank you. Oh, okay, cool. That's the first yeah. time Shieldred has ever helped. <laughs> Anybody. <laughs> <laughs> um, so Ben, did, would you sacrifice with Shieldred? Oh, I have to sack one during upkeep? Yeah. yeah. Mm, I'll lose a bear. It's fine. Give me another treasure! Algae Gariel, up to a 5-5. Five, five. Uh, Alright, drew my card. How big Shieldred? Uh, she is a seven, seven, eight, seven. She got protection. No, she's just an eight, seven. She's doesn't have oh, the. Uh, I thought she had the yeah, plate. She doesn't have that one. Yeah, only have four mana. It costs five to equip her. Okay, I'm gonna play this Winsup Heath. Um, let's see. So, Alex, <clears throat> what do you have over there? Uh, absolutely nothing. How many lands do you have? 
seven mana untapped. Cards in hand? <laughs> You're a psych rift guy. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven cards in hand. <laughs> does feel like there's a psych rift coming. <laughs> you don't have to attack me. I think you kind of have to. <laughs> if you can kill a player, you should. He's just going to psych rift, though, which is really annoying. Um, Alex, what are your land sources? Are any of them... All of my are lands are lands. They're all lands. I do have and, a. And what's that car? The uh, uh, Mall of the Skyclaves is still in play. That's an enchantment. Mm -hmm. No, it's an artifact. It's an artifact. Got it. It's an equipment. Um, a lot of equipment in play this game. In yeah. fact, every single one of us has had, a, had an equipment in play basically since like turn four. Right. People are loving the algae. I mean, so am I. That's why I'm so sad. You're going to get rid of it. You already ruined Lumbernaut. You ruined Lumbernaut for everyone. I'm not gonna get rid of you. Don't know you don't. I'm not. I, you don't know what I have. You don't have to attack me. There's a sh someone has Shieldred and that is at 48 life in this game versus the two 20 life people. I feel like hey, I got I got one card I can in here. Shieldred, I can kill and Shieldred I right now. Yeah, exactly. How are you how are you gonna kill Shieldred right now? I'll recast Daryl. I'll equip it with Basilisk Collar. I'll tap and kill Shieldred. Okay. Three. Because because it does gain protection from red on it on Joe's turn. Um, she'll dread more like she is dead. <laughs> oh, <laughs> oh, oh God! I'm so funny and likable. Am I gonna be dead though? Is the real question. <laughs> Alex also might be Hollywooding super hard on this psych rift. It wouldn't surprise me for a second. Alex, uh, how many cards do you have in hand? Seven. Seven. Jesus. That calls bluff. Yeah. Would I've you only, like to show us what they are? I've only cast four cards this game. <laughs> One, All right, first two, things first. I'm gonna three, four, five cards, five cards, six cards because you was, you did the thing with the shuffling. Yep. I think first things first. I'm gonna plus. I'm just gonna plus run in six. I don't really care about the ultimate. I'll get it back. I'd rather just have the value engine. Um, we'll get back this. Twist. Prismatic Vista. Um, I will I already play the land this turn. Then I will tap one, two, three. Shieldred, more like she's old Four, dad. <laughs> she's old dad? Psych rift, more like psych rift. I'm going <laughs> to cast Daryl. Any responses? Um, it's fine. No. Okay. Um, then I'm going to tap three, and I'm going to equip Bastos Collar to Daryl. Is it sad that these foils haven't really curled that much, and I'm okay with that? Yeah. I, I do think once you put them in sleeves, I think the problem is, is if you leave the new cards open air, they start bending really quick. But if yeah. you sleeve them up yeah. pretty quickly, yeah, they don't. Yeah, you sleeve them up. They're good. Are they're, there they're fine. Any responses to the equipment? Hey, Snuff Samson. Everyone watching, Not make sure shades. to follow. I have one card and I'm playing Golgari, so I have no responses. Alex, any responses? To you equipping Daryl? Mm -hmm. No. Okay, I'll enter my attack step. I will come at Alex for 5, 10, 15, 16, 17, 22. Woo. Ooh, that's death. Uh, I will cast Venser, Shaper Savant, bouncing your Ren and Six to your hand. Oh, good fucking bluff, cast. Cold blooded. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, Ren and Six goes back to my hand. And then I'll Teferi's protection. It's in his veins. I'll Teferi's protection. <gasps> Does that mean that you can't lose life and all your things phase out? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I don't. I I no longer exist. <laughs> that is the uh, okay. best use of seven mana in a blue deck ever <laughs> my life total can't change i have protection from everything and all permanents i control phase out exile that's until exile. your next turn right uh until your next turn yes yeah. i don't exist <laughs> i went to a cool. time hole there's wild stuff is happening where i'm at but you guys can't see it um i will end my turn joe isn't shielder dead uh wait Ian. it goes to joe yeah, yeah you're right i'm sorry i, I, sh I should uh 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's fine. Kill Children. It's a strong move. Oh, I'm sorry. I legit thought she was already dead. This isn't me nope. influencing anything. That's okay. It's all good. We doing we doing things. We doing Golgari things. I'm gonna draw. Um, real. How much of my character costs? One, two, three, four. Five, Instead six, of real seven, hot eight, girl nine. shit, it's real Golgari shit. Real Golgari shit. Fuck <laughs> <laughs> uh, being for... good. I'm over the dead. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I gotta go Gary Signet in the past. Uh, I untap, I exist again, guys. The time void, it was dope. There was an open bar, I there were just drinks everywhere. I got, I'm kind of wasted now. I'm gonna play Elsbeth's <laughs> son's champion and my dead. It was crazy, yeah. It's <laughs> you know, who knew everyone would come back as the dead? Mm -hmm. Uh, that walk. And they walked. There's a lot of walking. It's kind of like Lord of the Rings, but less jewelry. Um, I'm going to destroy all creatures with power forward greater. That's real annoying. Um, you tried to murder me. That's true. <laughs> true. It's a fair, it's a fair point. Um, Elspeth, all things power four or greater. Man, that's really good. Yeah, I guess I'm just gonna lose all my stuff. Droid. Yeah. You'll have some tokens. If there's any way for me to get around it. I guess I guess I'll crack Winsop Heath in response. Oh Michonne would have lived if she was out. Ooh. I'm sorry, Joe. I D don't know why I said that. <laughs> Dami will be right back. She's oh, it's, just it's doing fine. hot is... girl shit. I love that one too. Hot girl shit. <laughs> <laughs> Oh my god. I want to tweet that. Can I tweet that? No, I'm not going to tweet that. That's not funny. Well, it's funny. No, your joke was funny. Just It would not be funny if I tweeted it. God, put insert foot in mouth chase. I think you could. You could. I would be. Um, Shout out to um somebody in chat in my stream the other day who said that um at the at the age of 30 uh charcuterie boards are essentially adult lunchables yes that's and true. i have not been able to get that thought out of my mind uh okay they're there i'm going I'm, to put this in i like lunchables play. when i was seven and i like charcuterie boards now i love yep. does anybody, Give anybody me have any walkers uh no walkers uh no walkers Alex, do you oh, have that. any? I guess you have one creature. I have. You have, I, have, uh, I, have you... I have Venser. You can kill Venser. I will kill Venser. Mm. Um. Then I will go to forty-one, and then I will lose my Daryl. We'll go to the command zone. I will lose my Algae Gariel. I'm so upset. Algae Gariel <laughs> hasn't gotten the job done. <laughs> Titania will lose fifteen powers worth of uh, elementals. All you have is a two-two. Right? Another bear. Oh, bear, um, bear, bear, bears, bears right. don't Oh, you're right, you're right. Bear sticks around. Yeah. Bears, right. bear, yeah. Elspeth has nothing against bears. Yeah. Already pass, Cass? Yes, I pass. Okay. Untap, upkeep. I will draw two, lose one. Bonk. Oh, gosh. Bonk, bonk. Can't. Mm. Lunchables just has wine from the sun-soaked Capri region. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to um, tap two, and I'm going to destroy that thousand-year elixir. Wow, I'm just getting wrecked over here all of a sudden, huh? All right, you were gonna welcome to the party, pal. Yeah, you're gonna commit a murder. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, and I'm going to play Revel in Riches. Uh, you win when? Uh, on my upkeep. You'll just win on your upkeep. I will win on my upkeep. Uh, I will force a will that. Thank you very much. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to end the game, sir. I work in four hours. <laughs> That's valid. Uh, <laughs> I can let you cast it, <laughs> but I, it's terrifying. So is it countered? It's countered? Whenever a creature or a controls... I think I have to counter it. Yeah, I'm sorry. <laughs> uh, I'm tired. <laughs> <laughs>
Well, now we're gonna. <laughs> I don't know how long I'm gonna be up late now. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna. We'll, we'll try and end this. Well, a a worst case scenario, we can start swinging at you. I mean, do you do you want to do you want to play the treasure card? Do you want me to not force will it? <laughs> um. The, uh, Are we hitting a hard uh, out time? Well, I I have to be up at well, I have to be in at six, so I have to be up at like five, so that'll be in a four and a half hours for me. Um I can keep I can keep going. It's just I don't know how long the rest of the game is gonna take. It's okay. I'll it'll resolve. I'll just instead you how know. about we just how how about in fifteen minutes at nine forty we start doing the sudden death thing? Yeah, we can do that. We could yeah, okay. So so at 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 nine what fifteen minutes, so nine forty we'll start sudden death where basically every spell uh does five damage to yourself that you oh, cast. Christ. Cool. Cool. Okay. And let's try to um, and let's try to maybe play our turns kinda quick so we can like yep. six. I'll go down to five treasures and I'll just play this Obnixilis Unshackled. All right. Actually, I'll go. I'll tap this one land because I can do that. Um, yeah. And then I'm done. Cool. End of your turn. I'm going to discard this prismatic vista, and I'm going to make another two-two. I tap. never win with rebel and riches. People never let me win with rebel. <laughs> well, because you cast uh, it when you already have the win in play. <laughs> If you like snuck yeah. that in earlier, it would have probably survived. But now it's well, just a guaranteed win. I was win. gonna do it in earlier, but I heard you say I'm gonna get rid of a lot of permanents on the board, and I went, "Oh Christ, I can't play it now." I think you still want to recast right? Ren and Six. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, plus Ren and Six. I will get back this Prismatic Vista. I will play the Prismatic Vista as my land for turn. I will enter attack step. I will come at you, Alex. How big is uh, Elspeth? She's at one. I was at one. Do you have and you have any no blockers? No blockers. And you have how much mana open? One blue white land. Okay. Um, the other thing I'm going to do is go. Flying one, trample. two, three, four. Uh, let's go one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to play a hunted dragon. Sick. Um, hunt a dragon. I'm gonna make. Uh, I'm gonna give Joe three two two knights. A. They all have first strike too. Um, and then I'm going to. And then I'm going to come at you, Alex, for two at Elspeth. Uh, you have one mana open and six six cards in hand or something. Yep. Or right, I have three cards in hand now. I'll come at Elspeth with two two twos, and I'll come at you in the air for six. Uh, Elspeth is dead. And then, with the remaining four mana on board for me, I will... Oh, I will say, Chase, if it makes you feel better, I should have Force of Will. The... I had Force of Will in hand, but I forgot when you Chaos Warped, but I moved ahead, and I would have done it, and then I would have had that in play, and I'm sad. But, so... <laughs> The revenge for me being bad earlier. <laughs> I'll crack. I'll go down to 41. I'm going to play a walking ballista on two, and then I'll pass the turn. Uh, end of your turn, I'm going to tap. What was that? Play two more. So four, five, six, seven, eight. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Everyone brings all creatures from their graveyard onto the battlefield. Onto our plus, own plus. battlefield? Yep. Wow. Let's ramp this thing that. up. Uh yeah. Uh I get sensor <laughs> and even mind sensor. <laughs> I'm assuming other people have cool stuff that they're getting. Uh I just have my shieldred, a death baron, and but I have Gary. So mm -hmm. that's gonna be I'm gonna drain everyone for six and okay. gain six. six. Oh do I do I gain each one of the next life or actually uh, Gary life equal to the loss life of loss this way? So I gain Six, twelve, eighteen. 18. 18. I'll put a Winslow Heath into play with Titania. And. Yep. Cool. All right. Doing hood rat things. All right. Cool. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Untap. 
I'll draw top deck mode. Was that? Fire Forest. Oh, it, what, what card did you cast? It wasn't Living Death. It was... No, Twilight's Call. Twilight's Call. Yeah, you can pay two more to do it. Uh, instant Speed. Uh, on my upkeep, Shield or Trigger, nothing happens. Um, let's see. One, two. I'll equip the sword. Equip the bone saw. Voltron her up. One, two, three, four, five. Equip the commander plate. And I got some attackers now. Oh, what'd you bounce with uh with Vesner, Vencer? Uh oh, right. I get to bounce something. Uh yeah. what's scariest? I guess I would have bounced Titania probably, because then Ben couldn't have done anything in response to it being in play. Well, so we would have put them in the play at the same time. It would have triggered my land coming to play, and you would have bounced it before she was in play, so I couldn't get a five three. Is that the idea? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, you could also been... you could also bounce uh, Hunted Dragon. Oh, I yeah. guess I can it bounce. Can give you some two twos. Anything, right? It's any permanent. Uh, I don't think there's any other. I'm I'm good. I would. I'm gonna get rid of Titania. Back to my hand. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. All right. Um. So we get big old dragon over there. Well, Chase, you said you wanted to not be here, so. No, don't word it like that, dude. (laughs) (laughs) We won't go into we won't go into overtime if Chase is dead. You are trying. You are trying to yeah, trying to trying to get get this thing done. So uh, I'm gonna send my knights uh, and and Gary at you, Kess, and then Shieldred is coming at you, Chase. How big is Shieldred? She is a Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven, swamp walk, pro America, <laughs> pro red, white, and blue. I can't, I can't block her. Uh, I you can, don't you can block so. her with a w- black creature, or no, you can't because if well, you have swamps, swamp. if you have swamps, yeah, then, yeah you can't thing. block. Yeah, the swamp walk thing is going to affect it because I can block because I do have an obnix zealous, but. Yeah. So, how big is she again? Uh, uh she is. Oh wait. Well, I have the trigger, so I have to take ten from the Obnix list, right? Um, that's whatever you it, search your library. Is it a may? Is quick creature attacks you? Oh, you may. Okay. No, I'm not gonna do that then. <laughs> <laughs> but I had to. Even like, oh, even mind sensor is also in play, so it makes searching. Yeah, exactly. I would. Yeah, I would search the top four and nah, <laughs> I so, take ten. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. Uh, so six. Seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, eleven coming at you. Okay, I cannot block, so I am murdered. And then, Kess, are you blocking any of these? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I take five. Right, there are three. Let's be known. Revel had it. The knights are the knights are all three twos, right? <laughs> they are all two twos, right? Ben, they're two two first strike. Oh, two, two, two first two. strikes. Uh, okay, so then I will block. I will block. And then Gary is a three five. Yeah, I'll, I'll still block. I'll block. Oh, I'll block Gary and then one of the knights, and so then I'll take four. So I'm at four. All right, cool. So Chase, uh, I, then... me countering the thing didn't matter in the long run, anyways. You weren't gonna <laughs> well, make it know, to upkeep in the first place. I just wanted to win with money. <laughs> <laughs> That's valid. That's Jeff fair. Bezos for one, okay. <laughs> Don't. Don't all we right. all? <laughs> uh, I, pass, I pass the turn. Were, right. there any, were there any dead creatures in that exchange just now? Not on my end. Ooh. All right. Kill no creatures the died. Haven Mind Sensor and the Venzer. Oh, I don't they have both died. Okay. Okay. Algae. Up to 3-3. Three, three. I'm going to cast Tithe. Uh, does someone have more than 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 lands? Yes. Cool. <laughs> yeah, got plenty. Uh, I will get a hollowed fountain. Uh, I guess I don't want a hollowed fountain. I'll get two planes. I don't know if you had any creatures to sack on your upkeep, but I did not. Okay, okay cool. The life of living. Also, check out this tithe. It's dope. <laughs> Ooh, that is sick. Who'd you get that altar by? I don't even remember. I got it done in like 2010. <laughs> 
She's oh, like, damn. I'm okay. for that long. Of a minute. <laughs> so what do you search for like, three I, planes? I got it altered back like before, like when All Star Cards was like the main hopping spot on the west side of Los Angeles. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, yeah, I, I, yeah, it lets me find two planes. I can search for them because Chase is dead. <laughs> I am I am sad. But I have planes. Uh, I'm sad because if I had drawn a land instead of Tithe, I could have uh, chosen violence today. But I didn't. So here we are. Um, I will... I will end my turn. Okay. End of your turn. I'm going to discard this Copperline Gorge. Make it 2-2. Two, two. And also... That'll be that. Untap. Yeah, it was, it was someone literally at a, like, at a PTQ. Probably at the, like, women's club in santa clarita or whatever <laughs> and... <laughs> um wait are we still doing 9 40 or now we're not because chase is can go to sleep we, uh, we are now no longer we are no longer going to do overtime though chase when you okay. need to go and want to say goodbye feel free to let us know so we can let you do sign offs in the meantime is it okay if i duck out now i'm so yes. sorry now is now I'm is now so is the time sleepy. Uh, so first off, thank you so much. Uh, everyone, make sure to follow Chase on the internet. She both has a Twitch channel that she just streams on, a YouTube channel, and Twitter. She's going to tell you where all those things are. And uh, yeah. thank you again for coming and joining us and having fun. Yeah. Thank you for inviting me. I'm so sorry that I am a baby and can only do one game and I'm sleepy. Um, I uh, appreciate it being invited. I loved the Walking Dead card. So for me, this was really exciting to do. Um, my brain just is really bad with time. And I was like, midnight, I can handle it. And now I'm an old man and I can't handle it. Um, <laughs> but um, hi, everybody. My name is Chase, also known as Mana Curves. I'm a Commander content creator. Um, I stream collaborative deck building and paper commander gameplay on my Twitch channel at Mana Curves. Um, and I also post a lot of my content on Twitter, which is also Manicurs. You can find me there. I also write articles for TCG Player about collaborative deck building in Commander. Um, it is an absolute blast to do, and I love it, so you should definitely check it out. Um, and yeah, that is me. I played Negan tonight. Um, if you guys are interested in seeing something like this again, let Kess know, because I would definitely love to participate again. It was super fun and super cool to do. Um, Absolutely. And yeah, thanks, thanks you guys for letting me uh, play. Thank yeah, you so much for joining. Good seeing you again and hanging. Yeah, hell yeah. Now I'm <laughs> going to um fall asleep and 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 take a nap. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. Bye, friends. Bye. Good Bye night. Later. Bye. Boop, 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 boop. Gotta leave the Discord call. Now I'm gone from the Discord call. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'm gonna tap five mana. I'm going to cast Titania. She back. Ben. Oh, did you sack a creature on your uh, upkeep? No. Um, I'll sack one of these uh, bears. Cool. Uh, which will make Algae Gariel into a 4-4. Four, four. Sweet. Um, okay. And then I am going to... I plused... Uh, or no, I played Titania to get back this Prismatic Vista... Those things will have to wait till next turn. That's fine. Uh, let's go ahead and I probably need the mana for some stuff. So I guess Alex, you have like little to no nothing in the way of blockers. Is that right? Uh, correct. If you you can kill me with two creatures. Now I recommend not doing so if you would like this the rest of your turn to matter. <laughs> oh, are you gonna like wreck? Are you gonna wreck me somehow? Uh, I will use all my resources to make your life harder if you kill me. <laughs> Do it. Um, well, he wasn't bluffing the start the first two times, but hey, you never know, man. That third that third time, he's always there's always an extra trick up his sleeve. Um, what, what if you have Maul of the Skyclaves? And I have, I have, lands. I have, I have, Corhaven in play, and I have. 
four cards in hand, and Skull of the Kite, with the Maul of the Kite, Skyclaves hasn't done anything for a while. Joe, what do you have over there as far as creatures, artifacts? What, what's on your table? What What is the thing uh, in the middle? There's glare on it. I can't... There, oh, uh, the Death Baron. Got it, got it. Yeah, sorry. Oh, here, let me position that. There we go. That's easier. So oh, also, Baron, also Ben, if you let me live, I will put an Eldrazi conscription on any creature you want me to. Really? Yeah. I don't care about that. Kinda... That's dope. <laughs> You're gonna... you'll, you'll put an Eldrazi conscription on Hunted Dragon if I wanted to? Yes, absolutely. Okay, deal. Cool, done. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh, I have okay. seven men on tap, I guess. These back, these back alley deals going on. Hey, you're and at Alex. 64 and I'm at four life. <laughs> to make the deals <laughs> I can make. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Well, you know, Kess, if you give him that, you just kill yourself because I'll just sack Gary and then get him back with Shieldred. You can't. Oh, 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 oh. If you say, um, we'll, we'll deal with that when we get there. <laughs> i'm just letting you know <laughs> that's a that's fair but that's like two turns from now that means i lived two more turns versus dying now <laughs> oh you would they, they would die on my upkeep yes he, i would no, I, I would i would give him a little drowsy contribution on my turn i have oh, to live oh, to my I turn had, like flashes i'm like no, no, no I, I don't know why yeah i always right. think blue players can just skip the rules of the game hey they're overrated <laughs> <laughs> i'm gonna tap one two three four five mana I'm going to cast Vandal Blast Overload. That's that's not fun. Does it looks like your Shieldred is vulnerable? Oh, oh, it does make Shieldred vulnerable. I was like, does it do a oh. whole lot? It does. All of those equipment that were hidden. Buy them all of the Skyclaves. You drew me like three cards and uh, like killed a red and six. You did a lot. I'm proud of you. So we got rid of the what the the Animus, the sh and the Signet, and the Commander's Plate. Uh, Thanks, Signet, Snuff Samson for the follow. Uh, Commander's Plate and yeah. So you got rid of four on my on my end. Yeah, right, that's sweet. Uh, I guess. Do you have what kind of how many creatures do you have over there, Joe? Like, what's going to happen to me on three, your turn? four, five, six? I have six creatures. Um, so I have three the three knights you gave me, uh, a three four death touch, uh, the Gary, a two two death baron, and Shieldred. Okay, I'm gonna. I'll come at you for six in the air. Taking it. And I'm gonna I think just yeah, I'll just pass the uh pass the old turn. Okay. Looking forward to my Eldrazi conscription. But now what's gonna happen, and Alex probably saw this coming. Joe's gonna kill Alex. <laughs> So he'll never have to make good on the deal. I did. I did say that I would wreck whoever atta attacks me. So if I don't die, I have to make through with the deal. If Joe attacks me to kill me, then I have a way to to not not die now. I have one, I had okay. one way to not die from one of you. <laughs> gotcha. Um, I'm gonna tap nine. <laughs> God. And cast my commander. Dope. <laughs> uh, so you got two, two walkers. walkers there. Two walkers. All right. Uh, then I'll tap three, and I'll play a Midnight Reaper. Uh, whenever a non-token creature you control dies, Midnight Reaper does one damage to you, and you can draw a card. Cool. Uh, all right. And then, yeah, I had nothing to get back, so... Crap, you don't have... So... How much... You only have three land untapped? Me? Yeah, Ben. I, and how many cards in hand? Yeah, I've got uh, two fetch lands and a taiga, and I have three cards in hand. Three cards in hand. I have a walking bull list on the table with uh, two counters on it, and I have a titania with two fetch lands. So I have a, I'm going to be able to create two five threes at instant speed. Right, right, exactly. Hmm. Oh, you don't have swamps either. Oh, shit. Um, <laughs> you can force I me guess. to have it. You have the ability to come at me. No, 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 no. I mean, if you're <laughs> you making back alley deals, I'm gonna go ahead and let you. <laughs> I'm I've let like, you go, I've, I'm gonna let you go forth with this. I've held up my end of the threat every time. <laughs> that was what I said. I was like, you probably have it. So, um, all right. Anyway, let's. Uh, yeah, I guess let's just. 
I mean, try to chip some of this life down. Um, I'm going to swing at you with uh, Gary and the three knights you gave me. You're going to swing at me with Gary and the three knights? Yep. So, Grey Merchant is how big? It's a 3 5. So, you got a 3 5 and three two two first strikers. Yes. Am I missing anything about you'll just get cards off of the Reaper? Is that the idea? Uh, that and off of Gary's Death Touch. 3 5 with Death Touch. Um. I guess I don't really care about losing three life, so otherwise I'll just kill all the knights. That seems like a pretty easy thing to do. Uh, I, okay, I'll block Gary with Impulsive Pilfer. That's actually easy to do because I'd rather have that off the table. I'll crack both of these fetches. So 38. Make two five threes. Um, hopefully I have enough things I can get these might, I wonder if I'm gonna run out of searchable lands in a second here probably will um, so I get two five threes um, you have mana open to like oh. can you like give stuff can you like give stuff I death got, touch that I'm not seeing? I got nothing going on. What you see is what you get. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll block your I'll block the, the knights with five threes. One sure. each. Cool. Thank you. For I'll that. block the Gary with my one one pilfer. Alright. That triggers my Garial. Um also you lose how many knights? You lose two knights? I lose three knights. You said you blocked all three, right? So Titania and two five threes, yeah. Yeah, so, um, yeah, that's going to be it for me. And then the non-token thing doesn't work because there was a token. So, yeah, I'm passing turn. Sick. All right. I think it's on you, Alex. It is on me. Is this where I get betrayed hard? No, I, I like. I feel like I can't do that to you. I can't be that big of a villain. I like didn't have a choice. It was the only way I would have survived my turn is to make this promise with you that I now have to keep. Um, but Joe, I'd, I'd like you to know that if the turn order was just slightly different, I would have made you the same deal. Um, but we're going to have to deal with this on Jossie Conscription. But it's the only way because now you can't kill me on your turn again. Otherwise, you lose your Jossie Conscription. But then Joe just kills me on my turn. But that's fine. I'm going to live another two turns. None of the cards I drew do anything. Uh, Joe has enough attackers to kill me. And just kills me anyways, because Gary into Shieldred. Ben has enough creatures to kill me. He's yeah. probably gonna he's probably gonna get rid of Shieldred anyway. I'm pretty much out of this game. <laughs> like that was my one. That was your one. Slam. Your one go. That was my one. That was it. I was holding on to that, and I had not a graveyard at all. So. Who? Okay. Wait. I guess. So you guys, far. lose me or no? No, no, we have you. No, you, or maybe you we did. Am I still on spell table? Uh, yeah. nope, you're still there. Yeah, I, I see it. Okay. I don't even think gaining three life does anything for me. Okay, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna give this Eldrazi conscription to somebody, but Ben's just gonna kill both of us. So it's kind of just like letting Ben kill. Oh, he just can I mean, kill yeah, me pretty much with the untapped mana he has. But this keeps me alive. I'm gonna give Eldrazi conscription, and I'm going to put it onto your dragon. Sick. Like I dragon. Promise. So what is it? Plus it was it plus ten plus, 10, plus, 10, plus 10, ten an annihilator two? Yes. Love it. I'm into it. I like that play, Alex. It's a good play. I promised I would do it. I feel like I need to stick to uh, <laughs> if I don't stick to them, you won't keep my promises in the future. So I need to stick to them to make sure that it's like making your stomach sick that you have to do it. I, I can feel I, it. <laughs> <laughs> well, I feel bad. <laughs> for joe who has to now deal with this um but i survived so many back alley deals going on this whole game <laughs> <I> just... <laughs> all right anything else uh nope that's all i got shenanigans shenanigans okay and tap keep draw uh you got a second dude on your upkeep okay Upkeep, we will sacrifice a bear. 
put a token counter onto the algae gharial. So that's 8 8 now. And. So my dragon is currently a 16 16 flying haste annihilator 2. Cool. I love it. Plus 10, plus 10, trample and annihilator 2 for me. Uh, okay. I'm going to. Plus. Plus yeah, Arcliff, we did a whole six. whole game where everyone was playing Walking Dead EDH decks. Uh, the YouTube, the whole game and video will be on YouTube. I don't know how glitchy the one that's up there is now, but I've been recording it regardless, so there'll be a recorded version that will go up uh, if the regular version is super glitchy uh, tomorrow. I'm going to play this strip mine that I got back for Brennan 6. I'm going to... Got basics, tap. Twilight Mire... OG to, oh, you probably want to remind yourself to get the five threes. Maybe. Well, I don't have any. Three, I don't have like cradle or anything like that over here. We're gonna cast. You might just strip mine Darryl? my planes out of spite. <laughs> oh no no no! I don't want to cast Daryl because I can't with without a thousand year. He doesn't have haste. Actually, so it doesn't do much for me. You can. Uh, you can pump. You can pump your walking ballista and give it death touch if you want to do damage to things. True. Yeah, you're right. Uh, I, I can understand. Can. I can understand you giving them the Eldrazi conscription. You can't tell them. How <laughs> that's not fair. Beat me I'm that's like, just cold I'm as like, I am. I'm like puzzle solving the situation. Well, the Shield is going to kill me. If, if he can kill your creatures, I don't die. <laughs> if I untap, uh, right, so, I'm in, if I'm in, so, if I untap, so Vassal Scar goes on the Ballista. So what do you have over there creature wise? You've got Michonne, Death Baron. What else? Uh, Michonne, Death Baron, Shieldred, Two Walkers, Midnight Reaper, and Gary. Let's just start by killing uh, children. Sure. Uh, she is dead. And then I will take I'll take a damage and draw a card. Okay. Then I'm going to strip mine. Do you, do you have any double lands? Any, like, make, make two lands? Nope. There's a bunch of basics. And then I have a filter, uh, OG tomb, and that's it. Let's take out the... OG Tomb with a strip mine. Sure. Get another elemental. All right. And then I think probably the best way to do it is just tap four, put another counter on the walking ballista. Uh, what's your best creature you have left? I guess I guess the Reaper allows you to draw cards, right? Yeah, the Reaper the Reaper is pretty good. Or the pump or the the pump creature. Or the the death. Those are maybe the two cards. Reaper's really good though. Either one. I'm gonna take out Reaper first. Oh, sure. you're just gonna do both. That's fair. Uh, I life. Draw a card. I also want to clear as many creatures off the table as possible so that the Annihilator trigger has less options. Um, and then top four. Another counter on Walking Ballista. Good night, stuff, Samson. I'll, ta I'll take out the Death Baron as well. And then three mana left on the table. Uh, uh, I need to hold that back. I will enter attack steps. I will come at you for 16 in the air. Do you have any death touch creatures? Uh, 16. I do not. Okay. I don't have anything that can fly. 16 in the air, 11 on the ground. Um, and Actually, 16, 11, and then... Do you have anything that can block and kill a 5-3? At this point, you can swing out. I, I've kind of given up. <laughs> I can't fight two people. Whoa, 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 whoa. whoa. Not with the... Wait, wait, not with the uh... Don't give up. <laughs> I'll hold, yeah, Never exactly. surrender. <laughs> exactly. I'm going to hold back the 5-3 just because I don't want to lose. I don't want to lose it. So I'm going to swing at you for uh, 11 with a Shroud Creature, two 5-3s, and 16 in the air with Annihilator 2. So I'll, I'll take it all. All right. So 27... 30, so it's 37 and Annihilator 2. All right. And then I'll sack uh, a forest and a swamp. Cool. Um, I really need to do anything else. So, yeah, I'll, uh, I'll end my turn. Untap. Uh, all right. Harder the cars. Let's see. Let's see what this. we got. All hey, right. it's a forest. 
Uh, <laughs> All right, wheel and deal in time. I will not let Ben have a turn on his next turn if you let me live. <laughs> <laughs> he's gonna dis. He's gonna dis it. Whatever it is. I mean, that's cool. I, I would like. I would love some. Uh, some payback. <laughs> hey, I'm I I I'm just doing the bare minimum to not die. So whatever you need from me, I, I have a path. I have here. I got a sword, the plasher, and a time stop aimed at Ben. If you let me live. Oh, all right. Let's let's, <laughs> let's end, end those turns. I'm gonna uh, I'm gonna cast a Liliana's mastery. Uh, zombies I can control get plus one plus one. Uh, whenever Liliana's mastery enters the battlefield, create two 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 black zombie creature tokens. Um. I don't have a what did you sac- What did you sacrifice? You sacrificed two lands and I attacked? Two lands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, there's two zombies somewhere over here. So they can't swing. I'll find the tokens in a second. And then I'm going to tap five and play Chair Grid. Got a fright. So whenever a player sacrifices a creature... Or discards a card. Or discards a if card, you gain control of it. Okay. If it's a permanent spell. If it's a permanent spell. Okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah, it can't just be like a token or anything like that. Got it. Um, but it can't be lands. Yeah. So now, now things that make five threes no, get you. It's non-token permanent. If I sacrifice land, he gets it. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm including lands. Sorry. Yeah. So I mean, the five threes will happen the first time, but then I no get more. the land. So yeah. Uh, and then I think I have to hold up because now my zombies are a little bit bigger, so I have at least. I can block on the ground. All right, and Ben, Ben, uh, walking bliska, walking ballista is at at two two counters. It's at one right now. It's just a one one. It's a one one, and you have two lands. Three mana untapped. Three mana untapped. Okay. You you're passing, Joe. Yeah, yeah, I'm passing. Right. I, I will sort. My... I'll sort the plowshare. Your uh, walking ballista. Sort the plowshare is the walking ballista, huh? Yeah. Um. I'll respond by... You have no creatures, right, Alex? Yeah, I got nothing. What's your best creature over there, Joe? Uh, right now? Yeah, Turgrid. I'll kill Turgrid. Sure. Okay. <laughs> I've magically made it to an, an additional untap step. I draw... I drew an island. <laughs> um, What do we got going on? We got... All right, how much how much mana do I got? What do we got going on here? We got we got one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, all right, plus four mana, plus anything in here. All right, uh, I will pass the turn. Okay, I will untap. Uh, during your untap step, I will time stop you. Hmm. I don't think there's anything I can this do. This is actually one of the, my favorite cards I own because it's the non. I thought it was hilarious. The, yes. The, the, the non reminder text version just to end the right. turn. It just says end the turn mm. like a gangster. Like. <laughs> <laughs> Chef's uh, kiss. Yeah. So I don't even get a. I don't even get a draw step, right? You don't get yeah. a draw step. You do get an untap step. Untap happens, turn is over, back to you, Joe. Oh, I don't have your, I don't have your, your, uh, I'm not getting your board. Can you refresh? Oh, mine? No, 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 Ben's. No, mine. Oh, okay. That's why his walking ballista said, had two counters on it still. I now understand. Oh, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, I'm back. back uh, Stark6554, what is viewer games? I don't know what viewer games are. Hmm? Someone asked, do we do viewer games? And I don't know what that is. Nor do I. If someone's like, do you do viewer games? I would assume it was this. But they're asking while we're doing this. So I'm assuming it's not what we're doing right now. All right. Yeah, I've never heard of that either. Uh, I guess I'll draw. And I'll get a swamp. And I'll pass time. <laughs> okay. Uh, do I want anything in my deck? My graveyard. I don't think RS Silence does anything. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm going to untap. I'm going to draw for the turn. I'm going to cast Glen. Okay. 
Hey, Joe, can you tell me about your creatures over there? They're kind of glared out, so I have oh, a hard time seeing the power. All right. There is, I have four, well, two walkers, two zombies. Uh, I have a Gary, uh, Michonne, and then I have an enchantment that says zombies you got control get plus one, plus one. So they're all three threes? Does that affect the walkers, walkers. as well? Are they yeah. technically? Oh, yeah, creature token zombies. Yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. So these are all three threes. I'm, I'm done. I play Glenn. Okay. Glenn's here a, to, watch, to watch us die, as he's done many a time, fanatically. Uh, okay. Let's go. Untap, upkeep, draw. That's funny. Um, so I'm going to go. Remember, if you kill me, you lose Eldrazi conscription. <laughs> well, it still triggers on the attack, though. That is true. Um. So, hey, you got to a catch a small joker. Let's let's uh, run in six to get a strip mine back. Um, we will play the strip mine. Let's go ahead and I guess I sort of care about that. Sort of care about that. One, two, three, four. Let's... You're at 29, Joe? I'm at 29. Play a Garrick Unleashed. That's... That's the... That's M21 the one. Garrick. Plus one, up to one target creature gets plus three, plus three, and gains trample until end of turn. Minus two, create a three, three beast creature token. Then it's if an opponent controls more creatures than you, put a loyalty counter on Garrick. And the ultimate is minus seven. You get an emblem at the beginning of your end step. You may search your library for a creature card and put it on the battlefield shelf of your library. Got it. So I'm going to plus it. And I'm going to plus three, plus three, and trample. Uh, like Because it's target, Yeah, right? the face down cards but... are five threes, chat. Yep. Um, I'm going to plus three, plus three, and trample a one of the five threes i think is probably the best way to do it yeah one of the five threes i think um do you have any blockers alex you have glenn that's I have, it i have glenn okay um i think you might be able to take both of us out on this wing perhaps i will enter the attack step any effects alex uh no okay uh, I'm going to turn Hunt a Dragon with Conscription at you, Joe. I will also turn... I will turn Algae Garial uh, at you... Uh, I will turn it at you, Joe, I guess. We'll turn a 5-3 five, tra Trample will go at you, Joe. Um, and then I will come at you, Alex, with two 5-3s. Isn't it? Isn't it an eight, an eight six? Which one? The oh, one oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Trample. Sorry. So, 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 yeah. So, um, so a five three, an eight six, an eleven eleven, and a, the giant thing are coming at you, and I'm coming at you, Alex, with the five three, and also with Titania. How much is that total? Sixteen plus twenty six plus. And we'll shoot a Bassless Caller on the giant thing just for good measure. Just, 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 <laughs> just to get the life link. 30, 30, is that 39 I'm counting? Um, I'm coming at you with 16, 16, 11, 27, uh, 26, 27, um, 32 plus 8. That's 40. 40 coming 40. at you, 10 coming at you, Alex. Gotcha. <sighs> okay, so. Well, I got a sack too off. Off yeah. the swing, so do you, have, those, okay. do you have a way to kill either of things coming at me, Joe? No. Okay. I have, you I have, have no, no cards, cards in hand. In hand and, yeah, 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 yeah. And most of your stuff has evasion or blocking. I don't know how to save you. And, oh no, I'm dead. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna save me then. I'm gonna core haven, uh, the priest of Titania, and I'll block the other one. I should have. I should have asked about your lands, you sneaky bastard. I could have. I could. I could have taken it out with a strip mine. I should have just asked. Um. So you're gonna block one with Glenn and take out the other one? Yeah. Yeah. All right. 
Sure. Untaps. Does it untap it like Maze of Ith or just prevents all damage? Prevents all damage. Okay. There are, so, uh, there are five threes, though, right? Sure. Both, both, both five threes. Both five threes. Yeah, okay. Fine. I mean, I have, how much butt do I have? I have three. It's eight. Nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 20. I have 20, 20 butt on the ground I could block with. You're dealing with 40. I basically go down to nine. And the Algae Gariel is just an 11 11. And it, there's only. Oh, I could chump him. You just chump him. Yeah. And okay. one to five threes, so you can chump two. But there's okay. an eight, eight trampler, and there's 16 in the air. Well, 16 I have to take. So let's just do that first. So I'll go to 13. I go to 57. And then I'll chump the two that I can chump on the ground. And then there's another, there's an eight. There's an eight six uh, trample coming at you. Eight six, a three six. So and you'll, you'll trade, and you'll trade with the five threes, right? Because they're you're blocking. Yeah, threes. these are three. These are both three threes. Um. So yeah, I guess I'll tr I'll I'll triple block the eight six. So I have a three five, three five Gary, a three three, and a three three all blocking, just in case. Yeah, like. What? Wolf run or something like that. <laughs> oh, they're all they're all blocking the they're all blocking the eight six. They're all three are blocking the eight six. Okay, they block the eight six. And then so, um, who do you want to kill out of these? You can kill either Gary. No, you can kill Gary and a zombie because he has a, a five butt, and then these are three butts. Kill Gary and a zombie. That sounds good. Gotcha. All right, cool. So that. And then I took I took the sixteen. I'm at thirteen. Cool. And then second main phase, I'll tap one, two, three, four. Now I'll cast Pyrohemia. Uh oh. And I'll pass. Oh wait, wait. I I uh, mana drain your Pyrohemia. All right. It's mana drained. And uh, um. I'm done. Algae Gurriel is now a 14, 14. And yeah, that's that's my turn. All right, guys, come on. Uh, well, that doesn't do me any good right now. Uh, <laughs> yeah, my, cards, uh, my card uh, with Glenn Dead is way worse. I was hoping Ben yeah. would just attack me with one thing. <laughs> uh, I guess. Then I'll curse you with Disturbance. Uh, <laughs> whenever a Chanted player is attacked, create a 2-2 black zombie creature token. Each opponent attacking that player does the same. You are right. cursed for the time being until I get killed what, with that dragon. What's the curse again? Uh, if, so if you swing at him, you get a two-two dragon, or two-two zombie, and I get a two-two zombie. Oh, cool. Okay, sweet, sweet. Yeah. All right. So that's my turn. I untap. I have four mana for mana drain. I draw a card. I play an island. Sick, sick. I play Glenn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You now know. Okay. Uh oh no. Damn. Um Oh, I have a ton of mana. Oh sweet. Okay. Uh I will then play sword and I will equip it to Glenn. I will Pro black, pro green? Which sword? Pro black, pro green. Sword, yeah, okay. sword of feast and famine. The 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 old border judge foil promo one. Cool. And I will, pass, I will pass my turn. I will end of turn strip mine your bounce land, Alex. Yep. That, that's a... that. Yep. Yep. You did that thing. That thing you just did. I'll get a, I'll get a 5 3. And tap. Draw. Okay. Then I will... Ben's now playing. Now he's playing with us. I survived to the end game, but I don't think I'm getting past <laughs> it. <laughs> um, I will play this arena out of my hand. This this isn't like Captain America's not not th get, grabbing the hammer to get out of this one. <laughs> <laughs> it's, we're, we're in the timeline. The other one of the timelines Dr. Yeah, Strange yeah, was doc, talking yeah, about. Doctor not, Strange not, like... not in one of the ones. <laughs> he was like, no, we did in this timeline, fam. <laughs> yeah, this is one of the... This is a bad <laughs> one. <laughs> <laughs> you're at four alex and glenn is uh five five butt 
Is that true? Uh, yes, yes. Glenn is a a three five. I just want to straight up just kill you this turn, but oddly enough, I don't have like just all the firepower. I guess I could just swing out at you super hard. Pro green. I just need to come at you with two things. Yeah, I guess that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. We'll just do that. Um, because I can't kill your Glenn because of the stupid equipment. Because all my stuff's green. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna come at you, Alex, with the. Oh, and you still have Core Haven, don't you? And mana for it. Is maybe. That true? Maybe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you don't have to notice uh, that part of the equation. <laughs> I'm stoked yeah, you're playing I Arena. Guess... Is it that I'm playing it? The card Arena, yeah. Yeah, it's sweet. <laughs> uh, okay, I'm gonna come at you. Uh, I'll I'll start, I guess, pre-combat just because, just in case, somehow, Alex always manages to find a way. I don't know how, but he does. Um, I'm gonna cast a Lumber Knot because I drew it again, and then I will plus Garrick, and I will make. Something uh, plussed up. Uh, I'll put it on the... Oh, you're going to die anyway. So I guess I can just kill you both, right? I'll put Probably. it on the... I'll, I'll, I'll plus the uh, the token. I will attack you, Alex, with a plussed up token. Titania, Algae Gariel. I'll come at you in the air, Joe, for 60. Yep. Dead and dead. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Joe, Joe. Hold... Yeah, sack, sack things first. Sack, yeah, sack the... I'll sack the the swamp and a forest. So you're attacking me with three creatures, right, Ben? Correct. All right, I'm gonna uh, prevent all damage dealt by your dragon. Oh, with with what card? Core Haven. With the Core Haven. Oh, you can Core Haven any creature, sure. Yeah. Sure. All right. And then and then I die, so you lose a Jazzy conscription. Oh, I bl I also block Titania with my three five. So I lose Titania, but I keep the other things. You lose Titania, you lose Eldrazi Contribution. You keep everything else. Okay. All right. Lumberdot gets a token. Joe, I did, I did my best for you. <laughs> I hope you got this. <laughs> I don't even know if there's a thing that could get me out of this. Maybe like a... I, yeah, maybe Damnation. That would help. And then I, and I never cast Michonne ever again. <laughs> because... Um, all right, come on, heart of the cards. I bet it's a land. I uh, can't even cast her. Wait, can I? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Five, six, seven. Uh, sure. What does she do? Uh, well, I mean, her ultimate would have helped. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I could cast a Liliana Death Wielder for seven. Okay. Um, Death Wielder. Plus two. Put a negative one, negative one counter on target creature. She can go minus three to destroy a target creature with negative one, negative one counter on it, which you don't have. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I run this card? Wait, is it is it Death Mage? <laughs> Can't you return just a target creature to from graveyard to play? Can't you? Well, Ben's at fifty seven. Can you get like Shielder yeah. back or something? <laughs> no, she she uh, no, it's Death Wielder. So she Jeff her minus oh. is. Her, it, only her only her ultimate gets all the creatures back. Oh, it's destroy uh, target creature and control loses two life. Is the with wait, no wait. destroy target creature with a one negative oh. one negative one counter on it. Death mage and so, death wielder's art is like identical. From, from I know it look, it distance. really does look the same. That's crazy. I, actually, I, I don't I even know if I noticed I was that. Putting death mage in and put this one in by mistake. So yeah, we'll. <laughs> Yeah, put a bias one counter up to oh yeah, this is this is this is a this is the buy a box one, right? The like Yeah. Got it. Okay. So yeah, I put I put a negative one, negative one counter. Do you have a do you have an A one one over there? Everything is just huge. No, I got a couple two twos. I got one two two. Yeah, I don't think it matters. Uh I'll put uh, I'll put one on your your dragon. Cool. And yeah, I'll, I'll pass turn and die. <laughs> sick, 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 sick. Um, GG's. All right, Alex, you I you haven't heard a word from you yet about the fact that this game I had on lock with Ayula's influence the whole time because I feel like you love that. Am I wrong about that? Say it again. Uh, the fact that Ayula's influence was my constant throughout this whole game. Yeah, it was cool. I, it, it did a lot of a lot of cool things. 
I'm, I, you also built that deck like right before this game, so that was cool. Also cool. That is cool. Yeah, I built it. Pretty much built it this afternoon. I'm just proud that I survived for like four upkeeps. You, yeah, you you were in that game for a minute with four <laughs> lives. I was just like, how is this dude not dead? Even like like fetches or anything. Like no, like there was so much damage going on earlier in the game, and, were, and then all of a sudden stand still. It's like, N stop it! No damage. Keep me alive. No damage. Nothing. <laughs> Well, that oh, uh, wait, my uh, my Zulaport was putting in work earlier. Oh yeah, well, yeah, like, that, was, that thing was hurting your everybody. Your Zulaport plus Chase's uh, like arena is what what killed her before me, right? <laughs> right, right. Man, that would have that would have been the card I wielded in a slam. That was on the bottom of my library. What card? So my piece. Oh of yeah, I had the Dark Realms. <laughs> my piece of tech that it didn't come out this game is Burning Sands. I was like, if I feel like that's in the Daryl deck, I feel like that's so nuts. What is it? Because uh, whenever creatures put into a graveyard from play, that creature's controller sacrifices a land. Because technically, if you do damage to a token, doesn't it technically go to the graveyard? Yes. Yeah. Yep. Right. Yep. That's mean. So you, so Daryl comes down, makes three tokens. It's like give you token, strip mine, thousand year elixir, double strip mine. Oof. Like, Oof. Then, yeah. <laughs> Oof. All right. Well, Joe, thanks so much for joining. Yeah, thanks for having me, guys. For sure, it was this is so out. fun. I, yeah. I, this is my, literally the first time I've ever piloted this deck, so I, I kind of had no expectations about what it could do, and it exceeded my expectations thoroughly. So I will definitely be putting some some work into uh, messing around with this deck a little bit more. Nice, yeah, like same. I think that was what was cool is all, all these extra decks that we all built. They were like, oh, I like wouldn't have a chance to play with this deck because people get angry about it, and now right, just stop being angry, internet. Yeah. <laughs> Good times <laughs> yeah yeah for sure um any any shout outs you want to do before we do sign offs uh yeah go everybody go watch i hate your deck we just dropped uh episode four i will drop the link in there one more time for everybody uh it's on youtube uh yeah go check it out um and yeah episode five is dropping with rachel weeks in a couple of weeks in a couple of weeks yeah. <laughs> uh and yeah that's pretty much it man sweet and uh uh Make sure to check out. We uh, we do this every Monday night, 7.30 p.m. PST. Uh, we'll have fun guests on on a weekly basis doing Commander games and release the MMCast podcast every week as well on our YouTube channel, youtube.com slash the MMCast. If you missed this, like you came late and you're like, oh, man, I missed the whole beginning of this, uh, you can watch the whole thing on YouTube as well. So just check out youtube.com slash the MMCast. Follow me on the internet at Kess Wiley pretty much everywhere. Ben? You guys can follow me at Ben Bateman Media pretty much across the board. Uh, sometimes when I stream on Twitch, which is rarely these days, uh, it's Ben Bateman Streaming, so check that out. But, yep, Ben Bateman Media is the best place to find it. Thanks, guys. And make sure to check out our patron, which is why we are able to do all this content. And if you do that, you also get a bonus, like, 30-minute movie podcast at this point, basically every week from me and Ben. Uh, it's at the beginning of our early release raw feed. You get the whole episode a week early, unedited content. We swear, we make mistakes, and then like 30 minutes of bonus content at the beginning that we record just for you. Um, and it's great, and I highly recommend it. Uh, thank you again, Joe, for joining. Uh, thank you, Chase. Uh, make sure to follow her at, at Mana Curves on Twitter and on Twitch. Um, and we'll talk to everyone. We're going to raid Emma Skyward because uh, she's playing Magic right now. So let's do the raid thing. What? Uh, oh, the window is small, so I can't see the raid half. And uh, thank you, listeners. Make sure to follow all those things. BDGs did say before we leave that they loved, uh, love, I hate your deck. It's right as well. Oh, sweet. Thank you, BDG. Yeah. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Bye, guys. Later, guys. <laughs>